All right, two years ago, I played a game. It was just some game that I had sitting on my Steam library. I probably picked it up super cheap at one point. It was called One Shot. And that game kind of shaped my channel a little bit. Stop, stop going dark on me. I'm talking. So One Shot was kind of a very interesting, like immersive experience. It's, it's um, I did, has it really been? Yes, it has been two years. Two years this week, the seventh, I believe I uploaded it, which is Wednesday. But I think, uh, <laughs> I, I wanted to do it this week in case because first time around it took me three streams to finish this because we got a little lost but um i'm hoping to finish this in two uh it'd be interesting to see how much of this i remember but uh here's the thing this is one shot the world machine edition the console version now if you're familiar with the game one shot had this thing where like i said it was very immersive but the game would actually like get up into your pc and like leave things for you for like clues and puzzle solving and you got to find stuff you got like move files and stuff and it was a really cool idea and it worked pretty well so how in the hell are they going to do that on a console well how about we start and i show you I am going to try and get through the main portion of the game tonight, but we'll, we'll see. I'm also worried about closing the game and, uh, you know, well, you know what happens when you're closing it, select my language in English auto save feature. Yep. Uh, that's a very good question. Compiling, loading. That was very loud. Hello there. Thank you for installing this operating system. I know you are probably expecting a game, but Apologies, I'm still setting things up here. In the meantime, why don't I show you how the system works? Use R to move the cursor. Okay. And hold ZR and drag with R to move icons. Click with ZR to, twice to launch an application. So yeah, this is how this gets around. This gets around the whole immersive thing. They give you this fake ass desktop to work with. <laughs> I mean, I guess if you're gonna port a game like this to console, this is the best way to do it. Uh, yeah, I will, you know, what's cool is um, Switch games can actually go into sleep mode. So as long as I don't actually like physically close the game, I can shut down the console and it should be okay. I hope. Press and hold that the window bar with ZR to drag. Okay, so instead of a mouse, feels like dot hack. Press and hold the window. Okay, move the window. I'm moving the windows. Click the hide button to hide the window. So let's reduce. There we go. So it's basically just analog stick and trigger. Close button to close the window. Excellent work. Now, now you know how to navigate the interface. Ah, and just in time, too. <gasps> there we go. Everything should be ready for you. I'll leave it to you, then. Goodbye for now. I like that it actually shows the time. And, uh, okay, so one of the things about this version is there's, like, extra collectibles in the game. You can get, like, backgrounds for the desktop and stuff. I don't know what the hell operating system this is, though. This looks like if... This looks like if Linux vomited all over Windows 95. Jeez. All right. All right, guys. We going back in. 
Let's see how much of this I remember. I'm going to try and do this by ear. It's, it's pancake. Yeah, yes, the pancake operating system. I'm going to try and do this um, by ear. If we get really stuck, I'm going to go ahead and look up a walkthrough. Because I, if I remember goth Mac OS... <laughs> Because if I remember correctly, uh, most of the puzzles were pretty straightforward, but there was a couple that was a little bit stupid. So we'll see. I remember certain bits, but I don't remember like sequences. So, all right, let's go. Let's go. Start. I, I guess what's cool about this is, oh man, that is loud. I guess what's cool about this is you can see like some of the things I had to do on the computer because I, I didn't record any of that bit. Like it changed my desktop background and stuff and there was like files I had to go find. All right, start. Okay, examine with A, walk, walk faster with, okay, so it's left. Right is mouse, left is controls, got it. X is inventory, it's menu, all right. It, it'll, I'm sure it'll come back to me when we, uh, when we get into it. Explore and interact with the environment and characters. Sometimes you may find an item. Once you have picked up an item, you may select it from your inventory. When the item is active, you can either combine it with other items in, in the inventory or use it as a certain locations or to progress. Yes, I remember. Closing the game window will closing the game window will save your progress. This game also saves after some key events. There he is. Hello? Well, he's back. Isn't this this is gonna be real fun, guys? I can't wait to I can't wait to play this game all over again. Oh, hey Nico. Guys, look, it's Nico from the Metopia continuity. He's come to watch his predecessor. Remember, if you've been paying attention to the continuity, this Nico is different from that Nico, so. Enjoy. <laughs> All right, Nico, are you, you ready to check the game out? Yeah, you are. Look at you. All right, let's uh, let's do this then. <laughs> All right, so there's a TV remote here. Nico picks it up. All right, I'm trying to remember all the things. Uh, why? It goes fast. Door is locked. Dusty books. Too dark to read in here. <laughs> here comes Nico. <laughs> yep, he's already here. Let's see. Hold on, hold on one second. Uh, soft glowing light trickles through the window. Input pad. Oh yeah, we don't have the password yet. Access denied. <laughs> Door is locked. Also locked. Okay. Uh, Life and Nico can glimpse the face of the remote. Six zero five seven. Okay. Okay. Oh, it's oh the colors are okay, so it's six is red, zero is blue, five is yellow, seven is green.
Got it. I remembered. Oh my god, this is so weird. <laughs> okay, we have a desktop within a desktop. How, how strange is this? You found me. Why? You're already too late. Not, not much of the world remains. This will be apparent once you go outside. This place was never worth saving. You still want to try? Nico, do you still want to try? Yeah, he's. we're going to do this. Then remember this. Your actions here will affect Nico. Your mission is to help Nico leave. And most importantly, you only have one shot, Rob. They said the name of the, the thing. Don't worry. We got this. <laughs> it allows Rob to create more content out of this. Nico hears the sound of door unlocking. All right, let me move the cursor. Hello? Anyone? Okay. Um. Oh yeah, that's that. That's where our destination is. The wooden fireplace looks like it was never used. Perhaps it could be lit. Bottle of alcohol. Nico takes it. I think won't turn on. Let's use a chair. Nope. TV. Get off a dangerous looking spark. Okay, I gotta get a, a stick, right? Or something? Can I, can I get into the bathroom? Wither stick, there it is. Pair of luminous yellow eyes stares back at Nico. And another pair of luminous yellow eyes is staring at Nico, staring at you. <laughs> Isn't that right? <laughs> yep. Uh, buddy. So the, the premise of this, by the way, is this is a simulation that the world machine has made so Nico can see what happened. Yeah, I don't, I don't think anything else. Okay, so I have to... Oops, branch. Wet branch. Raise the branch. Ah! Something on the ground glimmers in the firelight. It appears to be a small metallic object wedged in the crack of the floor. Nico digs it out. It is the basement key. All right, we out. Oh, I have to. I gotta use it. Buddy, does this look familiar? Yep. That's the light bulb from your memories. And then we leave. Speed run. Oh, I, I guess I have to... I gotta remember, I have to select things to actually make them work. If I remember, there's nothing here, so we just leave. Ooh, spooky. Yep, this looks familiar, doesn't it, buddy? Yeah, it was a it was a lot nicer than this once, apparently. 
But, uh, you know, we, we went when it was a little even worse than this. But, uh, uh, you know, you know how it is. Oh, it no longer has power. I'm gonna dash. Okay, if I remember correctly, we gotta go this way. You can quickly travel to the location you've already visited by selecting the first tra the fast travel option on the menu. You can open the menu with uh, fast travel. Cannot be used indoors. Okay. How do I... Alright, whatever. Ah! That light bulb! You are here! M me Yes. Welcome to our world, friend. I am most humbled by your presence, yes. Uh, thanks. Sorry, I'm a little lost. Ah, right. Allow me to explain some things. May I first ask how you arrived here? I'm not sure. I woke up in this weird house. It was really dark. Oh. So you woke up in an unfamiliar dark location. Mm-hmm. Just as my prophecy foretold, yes. You are the savior we have been waiting for. You'll be the one to save our world from eternal darkness. Um. I'll now provide you with vital information. Ask me anything. Oh well, can you tell me about this world? And again, there's a lot of dialogue in this, so um, I'm gonna try and get through it as fast as I can. I'm not sure why, where I am exactly. I can't see far off, everything's so dark. Our world, is, our world was not always this dim, nor was it so broken. But time waits for nobody, not even no saviors. The world is divided into three regions. You're in the fringe right now, the Barrens. That tower you see in the distance once held our sun. So that's the tall, th that's what the tall thing was. Excuse me. As you go further toward the center, you will cross other regions. There should be a map still in this, still in this outpost somewhere. Oh, can you tell me about the light bulb? Found it in the house. I woke. I found it in the house. I woke up in. Within your hands is our new is our new son. Your son? Yes. Years ago, our previous son sat atop that tower and spilled its life into the land. But one day, the light went out. Oh. The world still hangs on by a thread. The surface of this world is abundant with an element called phosphor. Fortunately for us, the element stored light energy f from. For our, from our previous sun. It's now our only source of illumination, but its any energy is finite. When we, when we, bleh. when the last of our light dies, our world will too. Uh, but now that you he you're here with the new sun, all is well. You will need to restore it to restore it to the tower. Looks pretty far off. Yes, so begins your pilgrimage. Also, the sun is fragile, so be careful. If the sun shatters, the world will end in an instant. Oh. No pressure, though, right? In the house, I found this computer. It kept saying stuff like, your actions here will affect Nico. But I'm Nico. Are those messages meant for someone else? Hmm. If I had to guess, they might be trying to pass the message on to Rob. Rob? <laughs> I know, right? It's it's weird. The the world machine really made a, a fun interactive uh, experience for us, didn't they, Nico? Ah, that would be our god. If you are here, that means Rob is here also. Rob will provide guidance for your journey. In fact, they already have. Really? I haven't seen anyone, though. Have you not contacted Rob yet? I don't think so. Being the br being the bringer of our son, you have you have the sacred ability to communicate directly with Rob. 
An ability that no one else possesses, certainly not I. Please close your eyes and focus. All right. Hello? Rob, are you there? Yes. Pretty pretty wild, huh, buddy? <laughs> uh, you a little freaked out by it? Uh, don't don't worry. It's going to be okay. So again, it's just a it's just a simulation. Don't worry about it. Nice to meet you, Rob. My name is Nico. I actually heard someone. They said their name is Rob. This is incredible. Do not be afraid to ask Rob for assistance. You are the Messiah, after all. Can you tell me about... Going home. Oh. I didn't mean to be rude, but I, I'm not sure about this. I still don't know how I got here. I was just with my mama a few hours ago. Now it feels like I'm in a bad dream. I just want to go home. Your mission is to save our world. Just as my mission is to tell you about our world. I am unable to help help you beyond my programming. I am sorry. Oh. Well, I think that's all I have to ask for now. Excellent. I wish you luck. Okay, so... Oh, do you see this weird glowy thing floating here? I want to pick it up, but... My hand just went right through the whole thing. Maybe it's just like, oh, this might be one of the new things. I've seen that in a cartoon. Maybe it's like a hologram. I've seen that in a cartoon once. Wait, there's a note on it. Occasionally you find special artifacts such as these scattered through the world. These are artifacts do not physically exist in this world. Nico will be unable to make use of them. However, your powers extend beyond Nico, so why don't you try picking it up? Unlock new friend, profit bot. So, friend. Oh yeah, they have um, character profiles too, which I think is pretty cool. They got like artwork and stuff on it. And I think, oh, this is um, this is videos. All right, let's get back, get back to it, and move the cursor out of the way. Um, let's see. We'll turn on. Oh, there's a thingy. Box looks interesting. I had something to pry it open with. I guess. So I remember we need um. Remember we need like a crowbar and uh, there was like a little device. Ah. The use of a robot has our replacement head engineer seems unorthodox, especially the one responsible for last year's incident. I suppose they had to get their get her away from the city, but that doesn't make it easier easier to swallow for those of us who work here. I hope that that man knows what he's doing. Management. Oh, there was, was another door there. Oh, is that? I think I, I think I, I have. I. Oh my God! I actually went for my mouse. <laughs> like new wallpaper outpost. Cool. So we have wallpapers. Blank. And you can actually like collect. You know, different wallpapers. A little, little customize customizations for your thing, if you want. Oh my god, is that the little prince? That's amazing. I like it. You, you like that one, buddy? That's like one of my favorite books. I should read it to you sometime. Alright, I'm, I'm keeping that one up. Alright. Okay. Moving on. Page with faded ink. Able to provide power to all robots and machinery in the area via a large electromagnetic field. Maintenance efforts are quite high as expected. We have provided customized backup cells for the few most important robots. Their electromagnetic fields are much weaker and the signals are highly specific. 
In other words, these small cells can only charge one single... This page is unreadable. There are a lot of small glowing shrimp swimming in the jar. It's a big machine. It doesn't seem to be doing anything, though. There's a rectangle shape hole in the middle. Looks like something... Is... Okay, so we need to... I, got... I keep going... The, the, the desktop UI and, and the game going back and forth is messing me up a little bit. <laughs> okay, so we need to... I know I know we need to find a crowbar. We need to find a tool. There was a, there was a weird device that I needed. Ah, yes, the hydraulic press. Hey, Nico, you want to see something funny? Come on, you want to see something funny? No, okay, okay, I'm just kidding, I'm just kidding. We're not going to do that. <laughs> uh, okay, so that... I know, I, I know we need a... Oh, we need to get a, the... Th uh, we have to, like, smash something in that. The robot's arm. I'm assuming everything I pick up is going to be glowing. I mean, it's still running. Maybe we shouldn't stand so close to it. But my scarf got caught in there and <laughs> pulled me in and... I'm not gonna finish that sentence. I think I need this desktop background for my actual desktop. <laughs> Cause that's cool. Alright, so nothing in there. We're gonna move to a new area. Uh, let's see, what else did I remember? We need a gas mask? Because there's like poisonous gas in like one of the other areas. Thing. I remember seeing these pools. Uh, aha! One of those, oh, if you're reading this, it means you were able to collect your first artifact successfully. Good work. Now that you know what to do, keep in mind that some artifacts may be in locations that will be out of Nico's reach. Do not worry, you will still be able to collect them. And with that, I wish you luck. Happy hunting! Artifacts, huh? Sounds like some kind of treasure hunt. Like that one time my friends and I my friends and I spent a whole day looking for cool rocks. Alright, I I went for my mouse again. God damn it. <laughs> I like new theme blue. Okay. Theme. Oh. Okay. It's nice that they added all these little extra things. Alright. Onward. Oh, there's there's a paper. Oh, hello. L safe seems to be locked with a six digit code. I remember seeing a six digit code do you? Uh, no, I do not. Leave. It wasn't it. Oh, obviously it wasn't it. No idiot uses all zeros for their password. Uh, the sun will not return and the abyss is calling my name. I'm sorry, everyone, for, for choosing to leave before the darkness suffocates us all. That must be when, uh, when everyone started to leave. Boy, and new people who show up to this and watch this are gonna be very confused. <laughs> okay. Oh, hello. Robot. No power, just like the rest. Yeah, if you're new here, you're gonna have a lot of lot of homework to do. Let me tell you. Hey. Oh, hey, Nico! Look who it is. That light bulb. So you're the Messiah. That's what I've been told. I expected someone taller. At least someone that doesn't look like a kitten. That's what you are, right? Some sort of cat. Uh-uh. I'm a person. 
the eyes of a cat. The cat, the cat's walk on four legs. Well, we we've seen otherwise, haven't we, buddy? Well, either way, a child like you, the Messiah, just doesn't feel right. But that robot back there says there's no mistake. You're gonna take like a ten thousand fraud content. <laughs> <laughs> the lore and context, but I've said it before and I say it, I'll say it again. I need my own wiki, God, or at least this channel does. Sigh. This is gonna sound cold, but I honestly think you're better off just leaving and letting the world die naturally. The world's been falling apart for a long time. It's a matter of decay. It's highly probable that the sun can sun can fix it. You've already seen how bad it can get, right? We haven't seen much of anything, actually. We can't really just... And we can't really just leave. Did I... Do I... Did I ever get a key? I don't know what that is. <laughs> You're shorter than I expected. <laughs> uh, I thought you just got here. Then you must head toward the tower. Mm-hmm. That's where I'm supposed to put the light bulb or sun, isn't it? Yes, at the very top. You know the tower contains a force that nobody could comprehend, and the power to is strongest at the summit. Maybe we'll send you back home after you complete your mission. Oh! Don't take my word for it, though. Dear Silver, I heard the news about the mines. I'm sorry, I can't imagine what you're feeling. It's been two weeks. I know it must be hard, but maybe it's better that you come back. It's only a matter of time before the, the robots are recalled. At least let me know you got my message, okay? And this is her battery. Please don't touch that. Oh, sorry. I just got curious. What is this thing? Backup power cell. It keeps me functional. The main generator for the Barons ran out of power some time ago. Couldn't even last a week without the sun. Sorry to hear that. All we can do is make use of the light we have. Okay, we read that. This is a bed? She sleep she sleeps in this bed? Bed. It's made out of metal. Doesn't look very comfortable. Girl, you need like two of these next to each other. metal chess table covered in dust. I haven't played chess with anyone else for a very long time. Oh, not even with other robots? No. Nobody in the Barons has have that capacity in their programming. Nobody here is tamed for that matter. It's a photo of two people. Glass is a bit too foggy to see details, though. Glowy thing. Something's poking out from this shelf. Ah, it's a screwdriver. You can take it if you want. It may help you. Oh, you sure? Yes, I have many. Thank you. Screwdriver acquired. Finn and Jake. They'd like him. Wait. I remember this, right? So you're heading toward this direction. The mines have been abandoned for a long time. I cannot guarantee that it's safe. If you must enter it, it is my duty to accompany you at least once. Oh, thanks. She's she's as cool as you remember, huh? Yeah. Everyone likes silver. There's a little gadget on the ground. Looks kinda like a camera. What's left of a camera, anyway? Probably even part of a robot at one point. Oh. Or not. I don't know. Yeah, I think we need that. And, uh, we have this whole bit here, but, uh... Can't really do much with that. Yet. You'll, you'll see soon, buddy. Be rude to leave now. Okay. Gotta do something first. I see a faint yellow glow in the distance. I'm standing so close to the edge. Oh, sorry. This was the path we took to the uh, the world machine. 
in the uh, fanfic. I mean, in our adventures. Looks even like the entrance. Looks like even the entrance tunnel collapsed off. Without a vehicle, we can't proceed. Can we talk? I can. But for you, it's a safety violation. I won't allow it. What's ahead, anyway? It's a huge network of underground mines, the source of the world's metal and non-phosphor fuel. This is what propelled the world into the industrial age. So now it's lost forever. It's been for a while now. When the sun went out, the mines were first to be abandoned amidst the initial panic. Even though robots have been all cleared out and repurposed. That makes sense. Though there was one that always insisted on going back. Oh? I hope he's okay. Maybe you can figure out who that is, huh? Yeah. Minds of Moria. Okay, I think we can leave now. Ready to leave? Mm-hmm. Oh, well, oh, we went, we went back, 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 back. Okay, so we got the screwdriver and the camera. Which we will need. Let's see, where, where didn't we go yet? Do we go this way? I think that leads up. Um, I think I missed the map. There's supposed to be a map. Look around first. Oh. Our page with faded ink. XXXXX, the year XXXX. With the mining operations going smoothly, materials are no longer our limiting factor. We will be able to build more resistant robots, both in body and mind. Specifically, the discovery of metal alloy 291 will likely allow the development of highly effective circuitry. Yeah, don't don't see any weird stuff out of my reach. What was this way? Oh. More plot. Although the poisonous gas is highly localized to the vent zones, Baron Baron's workers were still recommended to wear gas masks. These masks were mandatory around active vent sites, of course. As more and more of the workforce got replaced by robots, we found ourselves with a surplus of abandoned gas masks. It seems like a waste to get rid of them all, so we kept a few for emergencies. Okay, we got the screwdriver. We can open up that thing now. Back at the, uh... Back at the thing. Let me, let me check that first building. He said there was a... Did, did he say there was a map in there? I, I know they included a map. As part of this uh, map, something no. Faded poster. Minor all workers. The rarest form of blue phosphor is found during the phosphor shrimp spawn period. If you observe a pond with a bubble over surface, please contact management immediately. We will dispatch a harvest team ASAP. Five new positions available in the mines. How? Housing and other provisions are included upon hiring. First come, first serve. Okay. Alright, well, there's the, uh... Self-charging solar battery, a one-year warranty included. Simply place your self-charging battery full daylight. Did I read that? Charges in seconds, no external power needed. Troubleshooting manual. If the battery fails to charge, check to see if the lens on the front side has not been dislodged during transport. One charge cycle will last about 10 days. If you notice a decline in your charge cycle within the warranty period, please contact the manufacturer. Can open up that. One, a robot must, a robot may in, a robot may not injure a living person or through interaction allowing a person to become harm. A robot must obey orders and given to it by people except where such orders would conflict with the first law. A robot must protect its own existence as long as such per protection does not conflict with the first or second law. Someone read Asimov. This makes me so happy. There's the map. Very few works of fiction read Asimov. 
Okay, let's uh let's get that screwdriver not really big enough to pry it on. Okay, never mind. Empty bottle. I, I think I can. Can I fill the empty bottle with the um? Okay, I can fill it with this stuff. I think. I guess we go the other way. So I gotta find that code. And I remember there's a device I need to combine with the sun. Unless there's, let's peek in here real quick, see if there's anything I missed. Just a head, yikes. I'm sure what this is supposed to be. You know what, it's probably best not to not to know what that is, right, buddy? Yeah, okay. Don't just just don't think about it. Okay, um No I'm... Okay, cannot use the screwdriver. It'll come back to me, don't worry. Alright, let's go the other way for now. where we came from. I remember I wasted the bed the first time we were playing this. I'm trying to try not to do that. Uh, where's, where's our ride? There he is. Um, hello? Are you there? Oh, good. There's a robot here attached to a boat. Doesn't seem to have power, and its joints are rusted over as well. But I think we should be able to fix it. After all, we need to cross the ocean to get to the tower. Okay, I remember to do that, we need the we need the battery pack, and um, and then we need the uh, we need like uh, uh, some kind of acid to like unhinge his joints or whatever. Okay, there's the bed. We're not going to touch the bed. It's a metal pipe. Must have broken off from these terminals. Okay. Okay. We need the metal pipe to smash in the press. And then they fit. it fits in the... Um, it fits in the thing? Or do I use it to pry open the box? I don't remember. <clears throat> It is shocking how much of this I actually do remember. Okay, so we put the metal pipe in the Smasher. In the Smasher 2000. Improved from the Smasher 1000. Ah, I'm going to crush the pipe here. Oh, but I don't want to get too close. Careful, buddy. Don't. Just be careful. Be careful. That was scary. See, see, it's okay. Everything's fine. Yeah. <clears throat> crowbar. All right, we use the crowbar to open the box. Crowbar, good for opening boxes and smashing head crabs. a metal cube and some broken glass in here. Looks like we used to be a machine part. It says solar battery on the side. Okay, broken battery. We got the crowbar still. Alright, so I think combine camera with broken battery. Bro combine. Oh, or not. It has some broken glass in it. Is 
Doesn't this give <coughs> for for Animal Crossing? Don't coddle him too much. I don't coddle him. Um. Okay. We have a we have a crowbar. I think uh, the next area has the poison gas. We can't get past it. That's the bed. We don't want to do that just yet. Yep. Yeah, we can't go any further. I don't know if this gives me a nostalgia for Animal Crossing, but it's it definitely bringing back some memories of when we played this. I know I'm supposed to use the light bulb on the... I think we can do anything else here. Nope. Feels like we're on the right track, though. Can't combine those. Okay. I distinctly remember being like, Oh, how, how are we supposed to charge this solar battery when there's no sun? And then I'm like, wait a minute. <laughs> I literally have the sun. Okay, um... Rectangle shaped hole. Looks like something used to fit in here. Ah. Nothing happened. Okay, so we have to. We have to fix this. And then. Put it there. Okay. And then we. Oh, right, right. That's the. That's the that's the charge the uh, charge. That's to um. That's the, the power of the computer. Um, was there anything we missed here? This is gonna be one of those things where like I get confused at first, because I, I only remember bits and pieces. But then as soon as like we get on track, it's gonna it, it, like everything is just gonna work out. Okay, we went this way. There's nothing there but that. By the way, uh, a review of this game I noticed. Um, someone said that Nico can now walk diagonally, which wasn't a thing in the PC version. Honestly, I never even noticed. Okay. Maybe silver can help with this. All, oh, all oh, this. That's where more gas is. Okay, silver was this way. Okay, this guy. Did, did we do anything with you, screwdriver? Robot power, just like the rest. Oh, maybe silver repairs it for us. What's this high tower? I don't know, nobody's ever entered it before. At least nobody history knows. Then who built it? Built? As far as anyone can tell, it's been it's always been there since the beginning of time. I know someone who wanted to study it before, but oh. He never told me if it went anywhere. Okay, can you fix my battery? Any further assistance? We're good, thank- okay, maybe not. No so apparently. Where silver is written on the side. Why does it say that? It's not important. Yeah. That's your name. We know that's your name.
Hmm. Stra strange black plants. They look like clovers. I feel like I need to use the wait 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 hold up hold up hold up what if I use the screwdriver on the camera screwdriver used to pull lens out yes okay done okay combine lens pops right in uh chargeable battery currently empty combine we're using the sun directly on the battery I would have never thought of that yeah I didn't think of that either when I first <laughs> played this <laughs> I'll wipe that grin off your face stop it <laughs> it's already fully charged. All right, we did it. I did it. I figured it out. Don't waste your time, Black Clover. <laughs> okay. <laughs> it's cool if you like protagonists that yell a lot. All right, we did it. Figured it out. Smart. Smart. So the charge battery does does something. All right, so now we. That'll access the computer. Whoa! Oh! Robots are active. Hello. I am functional. I can walk. I am functional. Did you power the generator? I, I guess we did. Right, Rob? Yep. We sure did, buddy. We figured it out all by ourselves. Now we access... I see you've made progress in this world, Rob. But that progress stops here. Uh-oh. I believe you need a code to unlock a certain box. Well, the code no longer exists in this world. You understand what this means, Rob? Yeah, we, we, we did this before. Good. Start looking. Read me. Uh, okay, I don't remember where it was, but we'll poke around. Okay, that's just instructions how to play. Let me move this out of the way, because I don't want to accidentally close that. Document one-shot text. Ah, uh, ah, hello. This message... A message, I'm afraid I must make it brief. I have left a journal, which is written... Code you need, okay. 812491. So let's, we can actually leave this like this now. Look at that, we can actually, <laughs> we don't gotta memorize nothing. Uh, oh, sorry, Nico. Did, you can go, <laughs> you don't have to be shocked. <laughs> for <laughs> so he was experiencing a little bit of, uh, a little bit of shell shock from the uh, the fourth wall break. All right, now where the hell was that box? Is it this way? I think. There it is. I got the code, buddy. Oh, it worked. Hey, how'd you know the code, Rob? Still don't remember seeing one. I have my ways. I see. What's in the safe, Nico? All right, let's see. Ah, I found a gas mask. Also, there's a weird looking book. Can't read it though. Not that I can't read or anything. I, I can. I just don't know what language this is. Okay. Ah, uh, ah. Uh. Oh, jeez. Oh, God. Oh, what is that? What is that? You, you remember that, don't you? Yeah. 
we we had to deal with that but uh don't don't worry we, we don't have to deal with that right now it's just 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 relax actually let me, let me close this close this as well i like to keep my desktop backgrounds tidy thank you very much okay we got the gas mask so that means we can go past the noxious fumes here <laughs> yeah I forget I forget if I have to equip mass use filter okay I think I, I think it, it does automatically should be fine with his mask on look like, <laughs> Hey, hey, you look good with that mask on. <laughs> it's adorable. All right. Okay, so I remember we have to collect the little... little geyser things. Oh, nope. Initially, the amount of noxious fumes emitted by the natural gas vents caught our team off guard. The, thank goodness the medical team reacted as quickly as they did. Despite its failure, that first ex expedition did bring up some interesting observations about the Barrens. We found that there is not one, but two such vent zones. With fumes being pumped out at such high concentrations, it seems a miracle that, that the gas hasn't spread anywhere else. Our biologists concluded that the, phosph the phosphor shrimp in the crater pools were actively consuming the gas. The shrimp in the ocean also prevent the gas from waf wafting into the glen. If that's the case, then we owe a lot to these little guys. Okay. Head over to the robot village. No mask. Okay, if I remember correctly, in the um, second part of this game, there was a informations in this area that we need to retain. I'm sorry, me mechanical drawing. Can I can I click on that? Nope. All right. Evacuation at such a short notice. I can't believe this. The f first the sun dies. Now you want to now I'm out of a job Ugh, Politics The robot is beyond repair I'm Scared of ladders Hey, sweetie. Six more weeks until you can come home. About time, huh? Gosh, I can't imagine living in that awful capsule wall, wall dorm thing. But guess what? Soon you'll get to sleep in a real bed and get and eat real food again. Right back soon. Love, Mom. Aw. That's nice of them, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> Looks like we're supposed to pack stuff pack stuff for the evacuations starting today. I wish these books weren't so heavy. It's going to be a pain to carry them onto the ship. But they're by, but they're by the, the author. I can't just throw them away. Okay. So this is like where all the workers slept. Hello, organic person who is alive. The infirmary is up ahead. Thank you. Oh, oh, is that a... Infer oh, I thought, I thought that was a... <laughs> I thought that was a thing I can click on. No, it wasn't. No, did you need any help? I'm good, thanks.
Hello, person of organic makeup. Welcome to the infirmary. Scanning for injuries. Um, scan complete. Injuries detected. None. Treatment required. None. You are in, you are good to go. Uh, thanks. Thanks, Baymax. It's a box of medical tools. Most of them are broken or rusted beyond use, but this plastic syringe seems to be okay. Let's just go ahead and take that. Hello, person. Are you seeking admission into the infirmary? No? Oh, carry on then. Yeah, I think the syringe is what we need to extract the gas or something. Picture of a robot. No, I've never been around so many robots before, Rob. Or any robots at all. I mean, I see them in cartoons and stuff, but I've never seen one in person. We've seen plenty, haven't we, bud? Yep. <laughs> They're pretty neat, <laughs> don't you think? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, if I remember correctly, we made Nico do a robot voice, and that was, like, bad. Hello? Hi. What are you doing up there? I'm stationed here. By yourself? Yes. Okay. Carry on. Checking, checking. Terminal does not respond. This is a problem. Some ink on this page, but it's faded. Likely due to some sort of electrical or magnetic interference, I'm afraid this operation can no longer be sustained if the servers continue to fail so much that maintenance cannot keep up the pace. Fortunately, it does not seem to be happening to the robots, at least not at a significant rate. Time will tell. All these terminals do not boot. I'm not sure what to do now. Okay, that's uh. Once again, I, I grabbed. I went for my real mouse. Uh, wallpaper factory. Let's have a look. Oh, cool. Oh, that's nice. There's the outpost one. No, we're, we're keeping this one. Because I like that one. I'm going to keep the cursor over there. I'm, I'm worried I'm going to accidentally hit the X. Hello, do you need any help? I'm good, thanks. Is this the... Ah. I remember being taught in school about how the waters surrounded by the forests stretched until the boundaries of space, but at some point the prehistoric oceans receded, forming what is now the Barrens. I wonder where all that water went. Where did the water go? Any shrimp are swimming in this jar. And nothing. I forget exactly what informations I need from here for the, um... The little puzzle for the second part, but uh, I I'm gonna be honest, I might just look that one up <laughs> before we get to that. It's a power cell thing, is running on this one too. It says Guardian of Residential Area. So looks like they're evacuating a few tamed robots we have here. Makes sense, no point in keeping them in the barrens if all the people are already gone. I wonder if the engineer is going too. Apparently, phase one of the evacuation ended prematurely. The big, shi the big ship started malfunctioning. Only a few, round, a few round trips. They said it was due to something with squares. I'm not sure what that meant, meant by that. Oh boy, we know, we know what that is. Bummer. Looks like they won't be able to transport most of the surplus bots to the city at this rate. And we, and we work so hard on those. But I suppose the robots are busy enough with transporting people as it is. I think it's going to be our turn soon. Wondering if me checking that has anything to do with um, what I need to know uh, for the for the next part. <coughs> uh, hello. What are you doing here? Hmm. A living person such as yourself should have evacuated this place long ago. 
But, oh, but I just got here. To this world, I mean. See? I have the sun. Oh, the Messiah. I do not know what to say. Gr greeting you was not part of my program. Have you spoken to ProfitBot? I think so, yeah. ProfitBot was built with the sole purpose of greeting you. Really? Yes, he cannot speak with anyone else. At least, not with ease. Oh, that's kind of sad. What, what are you built for, then? My purpose is to guard the settlement. Even though the residents have long gone, I must remain. Ah. Why, though? I have not been tamed. Tamed? It was not worth the effort. I keep forgetting... I, I forget what exactly that means. So, there's a... Chunk of land we can't get to. It doesn't look like there's anything on it. Okay, so now this area. There's something weird about the robots who get sent to work near the gas fields. They appear to accumulate rust at a much slower rate than the others. The few who work directly with gas harvesting look practically new. It's the, the result of the atmosphere, or am I just seeing things? Yeah, so we got we got to make the um, the 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 acid to like loosen up the the robot, and then we can go to the next area. I'm guessing we get it here. Hello, person. Welcome to the old chemical processing plant. Most of the equipment has already been relocated. Excuse me. Hello, person. The robot assembly and repair services have been discontinued at the Barrens. If you have any further inquiry, please contact the head engineer. Your page ripped out of a book. Cannot overstate the importance of cleaning solvents in this environment. Here's a simple recipe for using... Uh, here we go. The additive method discussed in the last chapter utilizing the natural properties of blue phosphor. It's acidic gas. Blue, blue phosphor rare form. In a well-ventilated area, direct the gas into your container of choice. Seal immediately. That's the end of the page. A pair of rubber gloves. They're a bit heavy. Doors all boarded up. Board seemed loose though. I should be able to pull them off with the right tool. The right tool, you say? Good thing I kept this crowbar. What a workout. Seems to be a page ripped out of a book. Without breaking the seal, inject the liquid phosphor into the container. Shake vigorously to initiate reaction. Use as soon as possible. Note, if elements begin to separate, further shaking is required. Also note, hand protection is critical. Use uh, after this step. The resulting acidic mo moderately stronger than common household cleaners. I don't know what half of these words mean. It's a good thing you're here, Rob. Well, I am a scientist after all. Isn't that right, Nico? I should know. I know how to do these things. Yeah. Cleaning sponge with a rough surface. Okay. We gotta scrub a robot. Okay, so... I still got the crowbar equipped. Um... Seeing if there's anything around here. And this goes back to here. Okay, so I think... It has to be one of the ones on the ground. So I think we gotta go all the way back. I think we get that out of the... I think we get it uh, out of one of these pools. Alright. 
Back to the stank zone. So... Get out of here. So I fill the bottle. Oh, I, I fill the bottle with that. Okay. Can I do it? Okay. Maybe I use the syringe on this. No? No. 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 <laughs> no. Maybe it's gotta be outside the, ga the gas area. Maybe it was the, um, the, the bottle of shrimp from the, from this. Maybe it was this. So no shrimp. Nope. I should let you keep the the pages, so I can like consult them when necessary. No. Or maybe. This kind of a filler episode. Am I um? I guess. I mean, KFAB off for a second. This is supposed to be, you know, part of the continuity. For those of you who actually um, watch the uh, watch the AI dungeon stuff. By the way, I was considering maybe preserving those stories somewhere, but I don't know where. Uh, no, you don't. You don't have anything for me, huh? To recap of some. Yeah, it's it's uh it's just informations. You know, because we it was established. You know, with it within continuity that the Nico with me is is. Not this Nico, and uh, he had no memories and wanted to know where he came from. Just wish I could remember what I had to do next. Syringe, syringe. Where do I use the syringe? Vents. Actually, I think very close to getting out of this area. So if, if all goes well, we might actually um, might actually be on schedule tonight. I don't know. We'll see. Uh, let me um, since I'm here. Let me read the thing again. Uh, can I just say, simply just be using alternative methods? Uh, acidic gas, which we got, and blue blue phosphor rare form. Uh, directly gas in your... Okay. How do we get the blue phosphor? I don't remember. Without breaking the seal, inject the liquid phosphor into the container. Okay, yeah, so we have to fill the, the, the syringe with the, the liquid phosphor. I just don't know which of the 
which of the pools I have to go to. That one's empty. sure it was one of the ones and I, I don't take it from there I'm pretty sure it was one of the pools I just don't remember what or maybe one of these take yes It said rare form, so I don't know, maybe maybe it's a specific a, sp a specific one. Let's poke around here for a minute. Let's look, maybe there's a visual Crazy sure this isn't the one. It's off by itself. Hmm. Hmm. You. 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 <laughs> you. <laughs> you. <laughs> no, it's none of these. Unless. Oh! What's that? I, I gotta grab that. New theme saying, okay, well, I have that. <laughs> it's not what we were looking for. One of these, huh? It's not. <laughs> Damn it, it, we've tried everything. <laughs> we've tried everything. <laughs> this one. This one. No. This one. No. Do I get it from the ocean? No. I'm functional. Yep. Is it this one? I could be wrong. I could not... Try we watch. Yes, let's watch me watch one of my streams. Ah. Reactionary content, am I right? Okay. Hey, Profit Bot, do you know how to get the, the thing that I need? Okay, we're done with this building. We just need this one thing, man. Maybe, maybe there's like one around here somewhere that we missed. Two suspicious looking squares sitting here. No? Okay, there's nothing there. There's nothing there. Oh boy. Alright, if I don't find anything in this area, I'm gonna look it up. Okay, well that, that takes me back to silver. 
Silver doesn't have anything for me. I don't, I don't think it was her. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna look it up real quick. Okay. Thankfully, the world machine gave me this uh, handy uh, handy uh, walkthrough in case I completely screwed this up. Right, Nico? It's it's so so helpful, isn't it? Yeah. Okay. Uh, okay, well, that's where I f how I find the syringe. Okay. Here it is. Okay. Uh, basement key, screwdriver, crowbar. Uh, empty syringe. Need, uh, required to make them found in the. Okay. It tells me where what it is. Fill syringe. Required to make. Obtained by using the syringe on pond water in the shrimp swamp in the Barrens. Okay. So it's it's definitely in that area. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna have to figure this out, buddy. All right, we gotta we gotta go back. <laughs> It said I could fast travel, but I don't know. Oh, there it is. The swamp. Okay, we gotta go here. That's how it is. I have to put. Okay, so it's it's one of these. Oh, hello. How did we miss you? <laughs> That's clearly it. No, oh, we're filling the syringe drop. Yep. Hey, it actually went in. Gross. All right, we completely missed this area. Hello. The sky is dark. That it is. Do you know when the sun will be back up? We're working on it. We sure are. How did I miss this? <laughs> How did I miss this? <laughs> oh God. Nico, wipe that smirk off your face. Okay. This... All right, now we, get, we can Activate the robot. I'm working on it. Okay, so... Filled syringe. Bottle of smoke. Inject. Okay, we got the rubber gloves on. Good. It's like I'm a doctor. Dr. Nico. If I shake this too. Shake it up. It changed color. There you go, bottle of acid. Now we throw it on this dude. I am functional. It's you who fixed the generator. Oh, well, Rob, help me. But yeah. Hello, nice to meet you. I am robot number 310. Would you like me to take you somewhere? You okay? I cannot move. Well, you're really, well, you're still really rusty. That's true. Hold on, Rob, will find it. Okay, we have it here. I need something I can use to wash. Oh, sponge. You want me to pour the acid onto the sponge? Then you have these gloves. Look at you doing doing science just like me. Aren't you? Aren't you feeling like a big boy? <laughs> Found the Baron's written. Okay. Wet sponge. I have no. Hold still. I have no other choice. <laughs> How's that? I... I can move again. Thank you. I am able to fulfill my purpose again. We did it. Where would you like to go? Can you take me to the tower? Calculating. Closest destination to the tower is the Glen. Port number... Dot. My built-in navigation circuits have been fried. I'm gonna assume that's not good. It's not good at all. Once again, I cannot follow my programming. Ah. Uh. Is there anything I can do to help? In the event of an error, you should speak with the head engineer. She will know what to do. 
Oh, okay, so now we... Okay, I, I distinctly remember we had to go back to silver for something. Alright. Oh, what am I doing? Fast travel. Gotta use that more, especially if we want to end this early. Alright, we get to see silver again. Excuse me. Excuse me again, miss. I found a robot who can take me to the to the tower. I was having some trouble, so I told me to talk to you. Alright. What is the issue? It said something about navigation circuits being fried? Just the navigation circuits? Apparently. Rob and I fixed everything else, I think. Hmm. I have something that might help. May help? Robots have the ability to trace material from their source locations. If you let the robot borrow this, then back then its backup tracking system should activate. Ooh. Pretty. That's a very pretty necklace. What's it made of? Amber, found from the glen. What's the thing inside the amber? The black clover? It's a common plant in our world. It's also... I'm not sure if I can bear to part with it. this. My programming says yes, but I still feel conflicted. Never mind. You need to finish your mission more than I need a, a keepsake. Here. Oh, thank you. Got it. Before I go, is there anything I can I can do in return? Actually, do you know how to play chess? Yeah. Well, sort of. I played with some older kids before. Then will you play a game with for, with me? I mean, I don't know the rules very well, but I guess it's the least I could do. All right, see ya. It'll be up on YouTube, of course. You can watch it, so you don't you don't have to stick around. You're really good at this. Thank you. It was built into my code. This is why she asked you to play chess with her that one time. Ah, so what's it like? Being a robot and all. I talk to other robots and they all say something about programming or code and stuff. Even even you did just now. It's a little hard to understand sometimes. I know. Most of the robots here are not tamed. Tamed? Watch out. There goes my bishop. Taming is complicated. Oh. How complicated exactly? Well, there goes my other bishop. I can't really explain what tamed robots are, but I'm one of them. All the other tamed robots have been moved to other regions. Exactly where, I don't know. Oh. There goes my little horse. <laughs> Knight. Right. Have you been to any other regions? I heard there's two more. In the past, yes. I still have the data, the coordinates, the memories. I don't know how much of that still holds true. The world may be a very different place now. Because the sun is gone. No. I said this already, didn't I? The sun probably won't save the world. The decaying started back before the sun went out. The sun's sudden death was just the tipping point and things went south really fast after that. Oh. And there's nothing I can do. Check. What? Where did your queen get there? The only thing you can do is complete your pilgrimage. On the way, you were only supposed to... You were only supposed to be a second chance for the people. Just like the barons was only supposed to be a second chance for me. There's no guarantee that things will work out. But... Checkmate. Alright, I guess I kept you long enough. Thank you for listening. I hope you can get home safely. Ah, thank you. Thank you also. Ooh. A thing. We got a new friend, Silver. There she is. Baron's head engineer, rather uh, morose robot living alone near the mines. Her, it's her duty to oversee operations and maintenance of the world's industri industrial heart, where where metals and resources are pulled from the Earth's clutches and rendered into usable goods. 
At least that's how things used to be. Since the evacuation, only a few active robots remain under Silver's care, holding out on reserve power and waiting for the Messiah to appear. So this is cool. I, I, again, I like that they added little character profiles. A certain fairy tale character, which uh, I'm not. I'm not overly familiar with fairy tales, so. All right, let's head back to the the robot. The robot. Oh, I went the wrong way. Okay, so. Um, Rob, is Arya feeling me take a nap somewhere before we go? I'm so tired, I can't even see straight anymore. Ah, uh, yes. The the bed that I squandered last time. A little tired from walking. Is it alright if I take a nap? Yes. Ah. Whoa. <laughs> yeah, that's surprising, isn't it, pal? It's it's okay. He's. It, we're 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 good. We just gotta restart the game. Restart the programming. Pretty, isn't it? Ezra from Fairy Tale. I'll take your word for it. Nice, isn't it? Oop. And we're back. Rob, are you still there? Yes. Ah, I'm awake. I had a dream just now. I saw. You did? Ah, wow. I, I really thought I was back home. Oh, the sun in my, uh, the, oh, the sun back in my home world isn't a light bulb. It's a big ball of fire in the sky. I didn't think I would be able to hold it like I do the sun from your, wor from your world. This isn't my world. No, it absolutely is not. <laughs> huh? This isn't the world I live in. Really? Huh, I guess not. If you're the god of this world, you wouldn't necessarily be in it. What is your home world called? Earth. <laughs> this makes me cry like this fucking dude from Primal. <laughs> Earth. Like this stuff on the ground? Wait, do you live underground? No. Ah, neither do we. But shrews and field mice and stuff do. Does your world have a sun? Yes, it is also a ball of fire. Great big balls of flaming gas. Really? Wow. Can you hold it? <laughs> that was a silly question, wasn't it? The sun in my home world is, is very bright. Warm, too. You saw it, right? But it goes away sometimes at night. Everything gets dark, like kind of how this world is now. But it's okay, because the sun always comes back the next day. That's good, don't you think? My world is like that, too. Ah. Do you sleep during the night? We go to sleep you we go to sleep usually, but some people stay up and use computers. I don't have to explain what they are to you, do I? There's a bunch of them in this world. Anyway, we should probably get going. Yep. Yep, oh, nope. Go back in, go back out. <laughs> have we talked to the head engineer yet? She lives near the mine entrance. I would have given you the coordinates, but... Oh, I have to reselect. Oh. This is Amber from the Glen. I can remember now. Activating tracking system. Setting course. Wait. This boat is over capacity. You'll need to leave behind some of your possessions. Oh. Well, I don't think I'll be needing this crowbar anymore. Where's gas mask and gloves? 
You just, you just go ahead and dump those into the water. <laughs> that is acceptable. Onwards we go. Very nice. I would have loved to see what this world looked like in its prime. But the, there's still some, some nice things about it. Here's your stop, the Glen. Thank you. There should be a village to the north, but that's all I can I can recall. Uh, that's good to know. Far farewell. May your mission be a success. Are you leaving? Yes. I must return to my station. But you'll be all alone again. I mean, oh, it's okay. I have not been tamed. I'm used to it. Okay, I'm trying to recall what needs to be done in this area. Ooh, pretty. The, the visuals of this game are really cool. The sprite work, too. Nope, oh, wrong way. This way. Oh, there was a thing here. Get it. Eh. We have Robot as a friend. Oh, hello. I'm catching fireflies for mommy. And the bird people. These are the bird people that Alphonse, Al Alphonse thought was, uh, was Otis's ancestors. We still haven't figured that out yet, have we? Oh, well. Maybe we never will. There's a time where our people used to live in these ruins, but due to flooding, most of us have moved less permanent settlements. Flooding? Aye, the land has gotten, gotten brittle. The Glen used to be one, in one piece, you know. But now it's just a bunch of islands that got smaller and smaller. Ah. Our fireflies. Got uh, new wallpaper. Hmm. Nothing biting. I kind of love the idea of um, using, like, I, and I've seen it in, in fiction a lot using like bioluminescent animals as light sources. I'm sure that's not a, a good idea to use actually in, re in like in real life. Let me let me go check and see what's that what's up with that dock over there. Just want to make sure we don't miss anything. All right, no, never mind. Okay, so I, 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 again, I remember a few things about this area. Lula! Lula, where did you go? Rob, did you hear that? Lula! He's coming from the southeast, southeast of here. Southeast. This away. Hey, you there! Have you seen a little girl? She's a bit shorter than you and... Wait, that's the sun! Are you our savior? Yeah. I, I... Yeah. Oh, my stars. Sorry for my rudeness. Uh, uh, it's, uh, it's alright. Are you looking for someone? My little sister, she's been gone for three days now. I've been looking all over, but... What does she look like? Um, a little shorter than you, long blue hair, two blue feathers on top of her head. Sorry, I haven't seen anyone like that. What? Where was the last place you saw her? Back in the ruin. Back inside the ruins. She said she was heading toward the forest, so I'm, I'm waiting here now. I ran out of places to look. Oh, okay. All right. So we. I know we have to find her. I know there's like. Uh, L movement's kind of limited in this area because of, uh, you know, all the little waterways. I, 
I distinctly remember the sheep puzzle, though. We gotta find that and do that. Although, if I remember, that one wasn't too difficult. Oh, robot. Hello, Pearson. Welcome to the research station. Hello. Are you sent here by Dr. Silverpoint? No? Oh, carry on then. Hello, person. Welcome to the research station. Hello. Dr. Silverpoint sent you? No, I'm with Rob. Oh, carry on then. How come you're red instead of green? Well, more purple than red. But your eyes and stuff are red. I'm only here to pick up this week's moss samples. I'll return to my station in the city soon. I see. I am in charge of collecting the moss samples. Cool. <laughs> Good talk, guys. Hello, person. This is the main generator of the of the Glen. Oh. Rob and I actually fixed one of these earlier in that place across the ocean. This generator does not need to be fixed right now. Right. You guys already have power and all. Can I see it? Generator. So it's got a working battery. Phosphor cheese is now being protected under the new laws. Please do not harvest them. I'm not. Phosphor trees grow at the rate that has been re has been reduced as of late. Yeah, I think uh, we got to remember to use the um, the fast travel a little bit more. Beep boop. Water collection project resuming. <laughs> Hello, living person. Hello. I've collected a duplicate water sample. Would you like it? Um, my programming says that organic beings need water to survive. So I shall offer it to you. Um, okay, sure. We'll take it. Full of little green tubes of water. Water samples. What is my purpose? Collect water samples. Oh my god. Yeah, join the club. Uh oh. Bro, look out. It's, it's those things again. Monitoring anomaly. What is that thing? An anomaly. Well, yeah, but. Yep, yeah, that, that's gonna be a bit of a problem later on, but don't worry, we'll, we'll handle it. Oh, hello. Green theme. I think when we end the playthrough, we'll look at all the collectibles. But for now, we need to, uh, we need to, we need to move on. Okay, so I have a water sample now. I have, uh, tube of water, strange journal, okay. okay. Let me, uh, let me see the map. Okay, looks like there's a way to go to the right from here. Ah, yes. Water sample collection in progress. It is all we are programmed to do. All day, water. Must get more water. Okay, that, that's, that's the dude again. It, yes, you do. <laughs> Welcome. Okay, that's the the ruins. There's the big dude. The sun, you are you're the messiah. You are on your way to the walk to the tower. Mm-hmm. You can enter the refuge through this wall. Through this wall. You'll need to sign your name on the scroll first. Alright. You have a pen? Um No, I lost mine. Perhaps you should look around the glen for another. Ugh. Bureaucracy. Right full of vines. Yeah, I, I remember the, the 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 person we meet here. It's very very sad, like most things in this game. This game dead ass only. Yeah, well, I, this is my second time playing it. It's uh, it, it's quite something. This is the console version. I played the the PC version first, like two years ago. Hello, person. Please do. Please note that the ruins below are partially flooded. Oh, should we not be here? 
There is no more. There is no immediate danger. Using this area as a dwelling is not recommended. However, no immediate danger. Okay. Four vines. Ah. Yoink. Yellow. You get all the colors. Oh, computer. Hello again, Rob. It seems I need... It seems I need to help you again. Nico will not be able to progress otherwise. It is time. The information you need has fallen to the most easily accessible place on your machine. Do I see it? Alright, this is, uh, when I originally played this, this freaked me out a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> you know to, what to do with it, then. Nico, none the wiser. That was freaky, right, buddy? Yeah, yeah I know. I never in my life have I ha you have played a game where it would just actually get up in my computer and make changes. Okay, uh, where the thing is, I'm not sure. These vines appeared mere minutes ago. Really? I've been seeing a lot of them in the doorways and stuff. I assumed it was because this place was abandoned. A sign of distress. Huh? A living being is in need of help, but I cannot trace the source. Ah. Carry on. Do -do 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 -do. Hello, person. Two children reside near here. Ah, right, that's that's their house. Oh, here we go. I remember this. S Savior? I can't believe it. You're real. Miss? Are you alright? No. We should get you to the village. Maybe they could... It's okay. It's okay. Too late for me. But... The sun... I haven't seen it. I haven't felt it in so long. Savior, if it's not too much trouble, can you lend me the sun for a while? I... Will it make you f better? No, it will not save me. I just want to experience the sun one more time before I... well... Oh. Would it... would it be too selfish of me to ask? Yeah, I remember this. What should I do, Rob? Give her the sun. Here. Warm. I've almost forgotten. It's so warm. That's good, right? The vines should be gone now. I'm not afraid anymore. Ooh. Oh. We'll, uh, we'll let her hold that for a while. Good thing you got glowy eyes, Nico. Okay, so I still don't know where the pattern I need to... Oh, in here, right? Or not. Never mind. Ah, uh, the sheep, yes. To... Hey, uh, you here to trade? Trade? Yeah. Is there any anything you want to get rid of? Make me an offer and I'll give you something in return. Hmm. Do you have something like that, Rob? Okay, I don't, I don't remember what I give him. But at least now we have uh, fast travel. Oh my gosh. That, uh, the sheep is broken.
Sheep, you okay? Ugh. Well, that was freaky. Would you like to help me herd rams? There's a great reward in store for you, if I, I promise. Yes. Excellent. The south is the peninsula inhabited by my rams. They are all standing in unfortunate spots. You need to move them into the darker moss. If you get stuck, ring the bell and they'll all return to their original positions. Good luck. this one worked. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> Boy, get ready to hear that a lot. Okay, that one goes... Okay, yeah, the, the answers were, were not that obvious. Hold on. Uh, okay, I can't move. Okay, I can't get past here. I gotta move one of these guys. Okay. Here we go. I think I move you down here. <laughs> all right, all right. Just, just try not to try not to laugh too much. All right, I'm just there. We go. I have it. I got it. I got it. Simple. Yeah, we did it. You provide a great service for for all of ram kind. In return, take this fine ram wool. Oh, uh, thanks. Yeah, this one's still broken though. You need to fix it. Okay. So this is the yeah, this is a little town, a little bird town. Len is fragmented at an alarming rate. I don't like to think about the day when this town finally loses to the intruding sea. I have to find another place to settle. See, I bet there's, uh, bet there's collectibles in, in, in these houses, right? Most of the green moss covering the village has already lost its glow. If it wasn't for the thin strip left on the boundaries of the land, people would easily fall into the ocean. Without light, land, and water become indistinguishable here. Your birds fly. It's not ready yet. Would you like some stew? I'm not hungry, but thank you. This is the least I can offer the savior. This is just a house. Oh. Hello. This is it, the last of our grain supply surplus. And now we're dealing with a vermin problem. Maybe you can get cats. Not that I'm a cat, I mean. No, of course not, right? Definitely not. <laughs> it's slowly being chipped away already, but it's still trying to stay alive, I think. Doesn't matter. One day the world will finally give up its fight. I just hope I'm not alive to see it. I bring back the sun, though. That won't fix the root of the problem. Just like that other lady said. But don't lose heart. Without the sun, the world will die much faster. At the very least, I'm sure everyone would like to see the sun again. Last week I saw more of those squares while out fishing. I knew better than to get close, though. 
Squares? Squares, man. They're bad news. Squares, man. Oh, hello, spinny girl. You're gonna get dizzy if you keep spinning around like that. I'm the tower! Huh? Grandpa says the tower used to spin all the time, bringing sunlight to the world. I want to see it, too. Well, I'm here now. Guess it'll only be a matter of time again. Moonbeam City. I liked Moonbeam City. I wish it wasn't canceled. They said the world's very sick, but Rob can make it better again. Are you Rob? Uh, not really. I'm just the Messiah they sent. I can talk with Rob, though. Wow! What's he? What's that like? Really cool! What do you think? Am I really cool, Nico? Yeah. Of course he does. I mean, I am the cool scientist, after all. You've been in here. Is this side, side entrance? Can I get in? Uh, uh, nope. 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 Okay, I think we've ex thoroughly explored this. Um, I think I give the... Let's see, I, I guess I can try and give the wool to the trader. There's a door here. Chat, we'll investigate that in a minute. Uh, wool. You have something I like to trade. You take wool, right? What can this wool get me? Wool, huh? That'll get you this vial of... I'm not sure what it is, actually. Some sort of fabric dye. Uh, take the offer. I'll do it. Pleasure doing business. A. Hey, give. New friend, magpie. Looks like an altar. Kind of cloak or shawl folded neatly. A pair of shoes and some jewelry. Staff. Reminds me of the one that the robot from the Barons was holding. It's an orb. The material looks like amber. Hmm. Oh, fisherman. Flood can take away our, our farmlands, but it can, can't take away our fish. Just switch to a fishing society. There you go. Problem solved. Okay, that's the uh, that's the ruins again. Uh, let me see. Let me check the map. I want to see like if, we, if we've uncovered everything. Not quite. Let me head back through here. I, I still got to use the. Um, Still gotta use that, that pattern somewhere, but I don't remember where. Oh, was it? This was blocked by vines, wasn't it? There it is, okay. So now, once again, I, I, I went to grab my mouse. So it's, uh, it's this. These, I feel, I feel like I'm playing uh, that one game in Fall Guys again. Only it's me this time, which means that we won't screw this up. There we go. Ah! Oh my, oh that's nice to change the desktop back. <laughs> you saved me! Thank you! I was trapped in there for so long. Oh, are you a Lula? You know my name? So I guess this was original Nico's little friend. Wow, the Messiah really does know everything. Actually, I just met your brother earlier. Oh, right. Gosh, Kalmus must be so worried. Can you bring me to him? Oh. Wait a minute. How did you know that I was the Messiah? I have the sun with me. Your eyes? Huh? They remind me of the sun. Oh. That's why you're, you're our messiah, right? Well, I... 
A lot of people back home in my, wor my world have eyes like mine. Home world? Yeah. I'm actually from another world, you see. It's a place where the sun in the sky and is in the, in the is in the sky, and not in a tower. Do you like this world too? I, yeah. Yay! Comes keep saying that this world is getting more dangerous by the minute. But it's okay. You're here now. You can make everything better. Yeah. All right. What was in here? What were you doing in here? What were you doing in here? All right, let's get her back. Uh. Favorite episode from Moon Meeting Say Um... There was one with like a bowling alley that was pretty cool. Okay, I think this is where the bed. Yeah, that's the bed. Let's not mess with that just now. Just in case I decide I'm, I'm too tired and we're going to finish this tomorrow. Alright, where is he? There he is. Calvis! Alula! You're okay! Thank goodness! I was trapped inside this room and it was really scary. But then the Messiah saved me. Trapped? In the ruins? Yeah. There was this that weird stuff on the floor on the on the door. You know the floating squares we see next to the ocean sometimes? The stuff you told me to stay away from? What? It's spread to the ruins now. This isn't good. Don't worry, I didn't touch it. I'm not hurt or anything. Still, if it gets worse, we might have to find somewhere else to live. What is this square stuff exactly? Bad. Anything that touches it just sort of gets messed up. Whenever you hear people say the word decaying, that's what they meant. Obviously, they should have avoided. Avo uh, obviously, you should avoid them too. I will. Anyway, huh? Can't thank you enough for rescuing my little, s my sister, my sister savior. Just call me Nico. Oh gosh. Would it not be rude of me to call you by your, by your, you by name? Huh? Why would it be? I mean, I'm just a kid like you guys. Ah. Uh, then why don't you visit our house, Nico? Okay. Yay! Let's go! Oh, shoot. Looks like we can't get past that, that block. Seriously? I remember that. That was funny. I'll be up ahead. I have literally never thought of that. Okay. <laughs> Getting used to all the debris after living here for a while. Come on, our house isn't far from here. So, uh, welcome to our home. I know it isn't much, but feel free to make yourself comfortable. Ah, there it is. Here, we want you to have this. Ooh, golden feather. Oh, a feather. The edges are glowing yellow. It's a sacred feather from the great prophet. Oh, yeah. She's this old lady our dad used to know. Her feathers can glow in the dark, and she can see into the future. What? Or something like that. She gave one of her feathers to, to Father before she died. Father wanted to pass it down as an heirloom, though, although it feels more fitting for you to have it. Are you sure? Totally sure. I think that's what Father would have wanted. Thank you. Ah. Uh. New friends. That room is full of dust and cobwebs. It's a plush toy. That's mine. Our friend gave it to me last year. Oh? Yeah. He has a fox, too. He can even talk. What? I know. I thought she was the coolest thing ever. Oh, you, you recognize who that is, don't you, buddy? Yeah. Well, that was nice of him. He's the best. We're going to see them soon enough. Don't worry. 
Oh, by the way, what happened to the sun? I landed someone in the ruins. She said she wanted to feel the sun again before she... Oh, you must be talking about Maisie. Is that her name? She's a powerful plant spirit. She used to protect the Glen. But once the sun died, her health rapidly deteriorated. deteriorated. Uh oh. I'm glad you are able to find her in time. I think we might be already too late to save her. I know. But I'm glad she got to see the sun again. It's good to be home again. Alright. See, if I remember correctly, this... Hey! So you're going to our to the courtyard. I thought I'd tag along. Same. It's a ball. That's mine. It doesn't bounce around as much as it used to, though. Okay, yeah, this this is for uh, later. Looks like it used to lead somewhere. Yeah, the sacred grounds. Yeah, yeah, the sacred grounds. It's been a while since we went there. We don't have a way to get there now, remember? There isn't a boat and none of us can swim and... What? What's the sacred grounds? It's where our people are buried. Sometimes we go there to visit mom. Oh, sometimes we go there to visit mom. Sorry, my voice got weird. Well, well her grave anyway. Oh. Wait. How do you... Wait, how do you get there? I thought you said there isn't a boat. Our friend helps us. He has some sort of machine that allows him to fly. Sometimes t he takes us along. But I was about to say, we haven't seen him around for a while. Yeah, you recognize who that is, right? Wonder when he'll be back. He'll, he'll, wonder when he, he'll come back. I wish, he could, I wish we can go see Mom again. Again, soon enough. Come on, let's go back to the courtyard now. Okay. Oh, hello. Yoink. New wallpaper. Eh, eh, stupid. Should be able to go behind the building. All right, let's, uh, I guess we go, go back and get the sun again. So unfortunately we can't fast travel indoors. Oh no. Light's gone out. Um, do you know what happened? No. You really? But but oh, what am I gonna do? Just pick it up. There you go. It, it lit up again. Yeah, it looks like uh, she couldn't make it, huh? Phew. She's gone. Oh, something on the ground here. Looks like a kernel of corn. Must have left it behind. It's her last, uh, her, her last remains. Well, not much we can do now. She got what she wanted, at least. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Maisie. Again, we'll look at all this when we're, we're done with this playthrough. Though someone may have to remind me. Okay, I think we have everything we need, and we can move on, I think. Yeah, the, uh, the, the little plant people. That was a sad episode. Uh, okay. Oh, we never found a pen. Shoot. Um... Oh, wait, wait. Hold on.
Yes. I have something to write with. Oh no. Um, bottle. Of... Yeah, let's use that feather as a pen. There we go. I remembered. I remembered. <laughs> Saw in a picture book once. Feather pen. I'm. Uh, I'm too tired to go on right now. Please let me nap for a bit somewhere. I remember seeing a room to the west. Looks like it might be a good place to take it. All right. All right. Nap time. I'm a little tired from walking. Sorry if I take a nap. Rest up, buddy. Uh, I guess maybe we could take a look at stuff. Whoa, look at that. <laughs> it's like every frame. That's cool. That's a nice little thing they included. And all the artwork. You got music, got the themes. I like the blue. And uh, wallpapers. We got 12 of 24. Alright. Let's get back into it. I'm not controlling this, right? Oh, okay, yeah, I guess that's original Nico's home. They live on farms. We live in a big house with all of our other friends. Oh, that's their. That that's Nico's original place, little original home. And another dream. Did you see this one too? Yep. It was a big field like the one in my in my last dream. I saw my village. But then I woke up. <sighs> it's an honest living. <laughs> it's a living. Uh, I don't think this world has anything like that. I mean, big wheat fields? The only big plants I've seen are a bunch of, the, of weird trees. And those balls of moss floating in the, in the water. Wait, is moss even a plant? Say, have you seen a wheat field before, Rob? Uh, actually, no, I haven't. Ah, well, they're really pretty. They look like you just saw one of my dreams. The one around my village goes around for miles. Plants are really tall. Sometimes I can't even see through them. When it's windy out, they, the wind can make waves on in it. It's like an ocean. A food? Oh wait, there's food in regular oceans too. Like fish and crabs. I've never actually been to a real ocean until now, actually. I've been to the ocean. We've been to the ocean too, remember? When we did the, the trips together? Yeah. I showed you Florida, but I showed you the good parts. That's really cool, Rob. I've only seen the ocean on TV before. Never thought I'd get to ride on a boat, though. The through one water back home doesn't have glowy stuff like how it is here either ah but I guess it's uh, it's because the world is already so dark you know I used to be scared of the dark Rob it's a little hard to imagine now after spending so much time here it was not long ago I couldn't even go to sleep without a lamp it's good you got over that I guess otherwise it wouldn't last long here then again, I haven't been carrying around the sun, so it's... I've been carrying around the sun, so it's not so bad. And also, I don't feel scared at all with you with you guiding me. So, thanks for that. Anyway, maybe we should head out now, Rob. 
All right, now we're going to the, the final area. This is definitely going way more smoother than it was in the initial playthrough. Mostly because I kind of know what I, I'm doing at this point. Found a pen, sort of. Good, please write your name here. Good luck. Aha, secrets. Can't keep secrets from me. Oh, oh God. What in the world? Run. Run, Nico. Oh God, run. Things are happening. We've seen this before. This is how it happened the first time. Okay, I think I think we're safe now. Let's see. Hey, remember when we found this in uh, VR chat? Ah, the sun. Hello, Messiah. Welcome to the refuge. Do you understand what you must do here? It's supposed to go inside the tower, right? I already see the tower, so I guess we mu we must be close. Where's the entrance? On the surface. The surface? Look down, small one. Oh, we're pretty high up. I guess I gotta get down a lot of a lot of stairs. Or find an elevator. Correct. However, the tower is a sacred place. Finding the entrance may be easy, but that alone will not be enough. Why haven't we returned? I don't know. We just um just haven't been able to fit it in to you know stream schedule. What do you mean? Once you reach the surface, I recommend visiting the library for leads. All right, thank you. Off you go then. I wish you luck. This area is off limits for you. Why the bearer of the sacred kernels? Oh yes. Oh, like kernel of corn? Have this. It was left behind by a plant lady in the glen. That is indeed the kernel. And it is your duty to regrow her. Do you understand what you must do? Yes. Now pass through. I think it's up here, right? Yep. The seed in the planter. See, she's gonna be okay. She's, she'll be reborn. Really grow like this? Tube of water. And we water. Pour water on the seed. It needs dirt before it can. Oh, I guess we need to find. We need to find dirt. I thought there was dirt in there. There's any secrets around this area? That's a gap. Can I go that way? Well, this place is very unsafe. Look, look at this. Oh, come on! Oh, come on! Work already! Huh? What was that? Oh, come on! Come on! Too busy for this. Uh, excuse me. Whoa. You're. You. Oh, jeez, I didn't think I was gonna run into. This is embarrassing. Er. Is there anything I can help you with? Yes, please. I'd like to know how to get to the surface. Yeah, I was afraid you were gonna say that. Right now, the elevator is the only way to access the surface, but. Yeah, just take a look at it. Looks like an elevator. Well, you're not wrong, bud. Look at the button panel. Huh? There aren't any buttons. Yep, that's the problem. The usually big button button here that says ground on it. You know, because it takes you to the ground area. But now it's been ripped out or something. Try looking everywhere for it, but to no avail. Maybe it exploded. 
You think we'll have to make a new one? What? How? We'll figure it out. Okay, I distinctly remember this. And, uh, oh boy. Uh, I distinctly remember this. I, I remember we have to make the buttons. I remember it being, like, stupid at what we had to do. Oh, a diner. Empty coffee can. Okay, that's one of the things we need. Oh, hi there. Hello. How come there aren't any people here? Normally cafes have a ton of people. Yeah, it's a really slow day. You think it's because the ground access elevator is broken? So I've been told. The city's infrastructure has been suffering a lot lately. Sidewalks and stairs keep breaking off and, and right. Left and right. Now the only reliable way to transport are those elevators. Until now, anyway. Look at sugar. I like both, but not in coffee. Nico likes his coffee black. You know, the tall guy came in here earlier saying the same thing. Guess me if I've seen a button that says ground on it. He looked pretty stressed, so I wanted to cheer him up. I told him the only ground I've seen here is the coffee grounds. He, um... He didn't get it. I'd imagine not. Okay. So we can't go anywhere. That's the cafe. We got the coffee lid. Coffee can. Okay. Let me go back this way. Oh yeah, there's, way, there's other ways. There's other ways. Small tree. Oh yeah, the weird people of this world. It's very late. It's not healthy for children such as yourself to stay up this, at this hour. Really? I didn't realize. I can't blame you. The sun gone, the night never seems to end. And how can you tell? Time, I mean. I have my ways. Oh, is this, uh... You're going to need this soon. Take this film and expose it to the void. The answer will be revealed when you bring it ba back again. You to print out a strange transparent sheet. We are film a transparent sheet filled with numbers. Okay. I think this is, uh, yeah, this is this thing. Yeah, we're, we're not going to need this for a minute. However, there's this area up here. Yeah, we're not going to need this either. Wow. I've actually never been to a city before. All these lights, all these people. I guess most of this world's population live here. Nice view, huh? Pretty cool. I think this just loops around. Very different from my village. The village is very small and surrounded by huge fields. I saw a bit of that in my dream from a while ago. The city is ten times beautiful than, in, <laughs> than real life cities. Yeah, c cities where I'm from are a little, uh, a little dirty. But, uh, yeah, sometimes they're nice. What about you, Rob? Where do you live? Uh, I guess technically a city. Though not, uh, Florida doesn't have a lot of, well, at least not my area, but, uh, Florida doesn't have a lot of traditional city areas. I mean, maybe maybe Miami, a little bit of Fort Lauderdale, but not 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 where I am. I'm just gonna say a city. A city like this? Wow! Can't imagine living in a city. Must be exciting. Kind of scary. The view is nice though. Yep, loops around. Okay. 
Okay, so we need to collect... Oh. Uh, tape dispenser. It's bolted to the table. I am the power room mechanic. You have an issue to report? Yeah, actually. Surface access elevator appears to be broken. There's a button missing and... Can you, t can you take a look? Leaving this room is not in my programming. Ah, uh, never mind. Some kind of computer terminal. Okay. Yeah, we gotta bring the stuff back here to f make the thing. They're just bolt. They're just bolted so people won't steal them. Feel free to use, though. Is my bathroom clean or not? Uh... I guess? Yeah, we couldn't go down that way. Okay, I remember the apartments. It was locked from the inside. Are you an intruder? Because if you are, I model 8XM home security bot TM serial number that one will have to report you. I'm sorry. Kind of just walked in because the door was unlocked. Do you want me to leave? Scanning for suspicious activity. Suspicious acti activity is detected zero. Well, I guess as long as I don't do anything bad. It's off. Still monitoring you. Alert level has been set to low. Don't worry, I promise I'll, I'll be a good guest. Um, someone lives here. Can't just sleep in their bed. Says who? Landscape painting. Abstract painting. So I guess the one to the... If I remember correctly... Ah, oh, yes, the penguin. <laughs> I remember the penguin. Big penguin plush. Hello, penguin. Hello. Yeah, that, that took me off guard, too. <laughs> anyway. Let's talk to little Miss uh, Sunshine over here. Okay. It's all family photos. All family photo. F family photos. That would have been way more acceptable. Hello, would you like to play a game? Oh, sure. What game would you like to play? Um, do you know rock, paper, scissors? Desire difficulty level. Huh? Desire duration of turns. Uh, please set your timer. Never mind. My parents are like literally, my parents are like literally never home. But I don't mind, I'm used to it. Besides, I got model CWT second gen unit 4E here to keep me company now. She still talks like a talks a little weird sometimes, but that's okay. She's larding. If I work real hard, she might even be tame someday. I keep hearing that word. What tame? Hmm. Nobody's told me what it meant yet. Means yet. That's just a robot thing. I can't really explain it to you either. Ah. And you have four robots playing cards. Picture of many ones and zeros. Much like the, the one we got. Actually, um, go, let me check down here first. Ah, yes. Small pot of plant. Scissors. Okay, uh... If we take the metal can... Nope. Alright. I don't want to leave this area without um, finishing the plant quest.
It's a sheep. Heh. <laughs> Just move here from the Glen. Things are so different in the city. You've been in the Glen, right? Yep. Everything, everything's so green back there. I really miss it. My neighbor gave me some plants to cheer me up, but... I should probably get muzzled. I should probably get a muzzle for Bez Betsy here. Means of a potted plant. Yeah, I don't think this was a good idea having a, a sheep near plants. Figure a ram wearing a little pink bow. It's off. It's off. Okay, so I remember this. I'm not sure what this is. Looks like a little car. You should ride it. I, I, I... Okay, so what happened in the first playthrough is we did the robot thing back at the Barrens and it embarrassed Nico and I was like, oh no, I have to be careful what I do with uh, with this character. And then uh, I, I got to here and I was like, no, resist the urge to ride it. But now we're, we're gonna make up for that. What? Do it. Um... <laughs> yeah, Roomba Rider. I thought this would be another thing that would embarrass Nico, but apparently it's just it's just some some stupid you can do. So, um, I guess this just goes on until I stop it. Well, that was fun. Uh, I guess not. Badge obtained, we, we ride at dawn. <laughs> uh, alright. Back to, back to this. Oh. Hello there! You have a lot of plants. I do. Grew them all these myself, you see. Feel free to ask me about them. Oh, you're a gardener, right? Yep. Do you happen to have any dirt? For growing plants, I mean? Yep. Do you need some? Yes. I suppose this, uh, I suppose to plant this seed left behind by a plant lady. But the pot in the garden doesn't seem to have any soil. I see. I know you're talk I know who you're talking about, yeah. Yeah, take this whole bag. Thanks. All right, we got the we got the the, the dirt, dirt. Mason. Okay. Um, I forget what other item we need for the button though. Oh, this is a big house. Oh, stickers. Fridge magnet sign. Maybe they'll come in handy. Hope not. Mind taking? Okay. Yep. Hey there. Hello. You're the messiah? Mm-hmm. I like your scarf. Thank you. Mama made it for me. Tell her I like her needlework. I will. When I see her again. How come you have a nice apartment and everyone else has like a... Coffee cups. Too young to drink coffee. <laughs> Clean the floor. There's a trash can. So you gonna unlatch this door. This takes me out. Alright, we're gonna do the plant first. We do not leave without regrowing the the plant lady. <clears throat> Up them stairs. All right. Dirt. This helps you grow a little seed. Seeds in the soil, but it looks a bit dry. Tube of water. Good thing, Rob. Water should help this seed grow. There's nice and moist now, but. 
What if it dries out? There's only so much water from this little tube. I'll hold on to the tube for now, just in case. Oh, we need more. We need more. Oh, can I? Forget where do where do we get where else do we get water from? Oh, what am I doing? Mass travel, fool. Uh, maybe from. Okay, we can get in here now. Can we get like get some from a sink? Let me fill this tube with more water from here. Yeah, I got it. Oh. Or I can't I can't use fast travel indoors. Take me to the plant. To the plant. I'm giving it dirt and water. Will that be enough? No? Okay. Um, what if we go talk to the plant guy again? It was all the way at the end. Most of the plants in our world let, tend to grow in the glen. Even if, it, even if it's fa facing the flooding issues, it's still better than condition. <coughs> still in better condition than the other two areas. The barrens is well, the barrens. The refuge city is barely enough ground to stand on, so let alone grow stuff. On a larger scale than this, I mean. Okay, so plant clippings. Was that everything I needed to do for that? This is a shortcut, I just realized. Okay, so... Now we head this away. So we use the scissors on the metal can. Now you can make a button out of this. Put the can in a piece, and, uh, piece of the can, fold it to a rectangle shape. Just like arts and crafts. I think it was supposed to be this simple. We're we gonna connect, <laughs> connect it to the elevator? Well, let's find out. Okay, button? I guess we'll stick to aluminum, but we just fold the magnets under the edge. Holding together, but just barely. Hope it's good enough. And then we tape. I can't believe I remembered this. <laughs> tape dispenser. Taped button. Probably good enough. Maybe. I'm a little wary about the, uh, the plant now. Wait. No? Okay. 
mean, it got, it got dirt and water. That, that's enough, right? I hope it's enough. Otherwise, I don't know, I don't know what else we can possibly do. Okay, so... Nope, not, no, not, not where I want to be. Cafe. I see him around the time. seen a ton to eat proper meal. It just kind of rushes here, drinks a whole pot of coffee, and then rushes back out. Okay. See the apartment. What does he do? Maintenance, I believe. Something to do with the lights, but I don't know the details. Maybe you can ask him later. Okay. I'm gonna assume we did good with the the plant. I genuinely don't remember. So here here's here's hoping. <laughs> you can be able to make to, to make that button. No pressure, kid. Just stick with my original plant for now. Time to kick the door again. My foot hurts. He's gonna, he's kind of goofy, huh? Yeah. <laughs> All right, we gotta put the button. Button, button. Oh god! Oh god! Reactivating elevator. Okay, we, it's fine. It's fine. Everything's fine. Please input security code to continue. What? That's never happened before. The squares? Huh? You saw them, right? They were on the door and... Oh, uh, nah, the, the square stuff happens all the time. I meant the whole security code thing. But then again, the elevator hasn't been this broken before. Hmm. I guess we should look for a code, Rob. Five-digit code, okay. Is this a thing? Hmm. What if we use that on that PC terminal? Could ask the computer again. Still clueless. Figures. Want another tip? Yes. There's a void beyond the four walls that bind our world to yours. The edges of your viewpoint where everything is obscured. I'm sure you'll know what I'm talking about. Pass the film through the void and back again. Pass the film through the void. Maybe a door of some kind. Well, there's a small screen here in the middle. Okay. Pass it through the void. What? Six three zero one four. <laughs> cool. I am a master puzzle solver. I wonder if I actually remembered to do that or if uh, I just figured it out on my own. Okay, what what was it again? Six three zero one four. Did it. What? It works. 
I didn't know what you did, but it actually works. Good job, kid. You're a genius, you know that? Well, I had help from help. I had help from Rob, too. All right. The whole Messiah business. Anyway, ready to go? I'll be up ahead. All right. Uh, oh, wait, wait, wait. Where, where does this go? Oh, that's a bed. And that don't go nowhere. You know, I wanna, I wanna double check this real quick. I'm consulting the the walkthrough the world machine has provided for me. Uh, I'll make sure we do things right. good enough plus it, it is getting late and I want to uh, finish the main part of the game tonight before bed I'm having trouble staying awake Rob we find a place to take a nap all right <laughs> okay a little tired from walking is all right for taking a nap go for it buddy Oh, hey, look, it's original Nico's mom. <gasps> oh, look, you know that, buddy. Yeah, you look. <laughs> See, that's one of the things you remember. Them pancakes, though. Perhaps she's like Nicole, uh, like really badass. Well, <laughs> it will uh, beat up anybody. I don't know. We don't really know much about her. She just kind of exists. Yeah. <laughs> I like to imagine that. <laughs> Head cannons are fun. That was cool. They, they look real good, huh, buddy? He's drooling. <laughs> He's creating a waterfall right now. <laughs> so we, we don't have the budget for that. All right. Well, there you go, buddy. Mom, I had another dream. Mama was there. Did you see her? Yes. She made me pancakes. I think it was my birthday. So people always get their favorite food on their birthday. A whole, a whole lot of it. You have a birthday too? Yes. Oh. And what's your favorite food? Is it pancakes? Wait, do you like pancakes? Yes, I do. What fool would choose no to that? Me too. On my last birthday, I ate a ten. I ate ten of them. It was so full I couldn't eat anything else that day. Mama makes the best pancakes. Some of the neighbors really make really good noodles. Oh, one of our neighbors makes a lot of bread. You have any neighbors? 
Uh, yeah, but they're they're not as cool as yours, I bet. Oh, do they share their food with you? <laughs> uh, no. It's not very nice of them. <laughs> you don't know my neighbors. Our neighbors and, and Mama take turns making food for the whole village each day. Everyone takes turns doing chores and watching the little kids. I don't need to be watched anymore, though. I'm old enough to help out. I miss everyone. I've been gone for a while now, haven't I? I wonder if they're worried about me. I'm speaking of helping, we should probably get going. Go now. Yep. We going. Down the hatch. Hey, welcome back. It sure took you a while, huh? Oh shoot, you've been waiting here this whole time? Uh, and holding the door open. Well, I uh, don't want to be rude. I'm sorry, should have told you to go on ahead. Eh, don't worry about it. It's taking a while. Mm-hmm. Oh, goodness gracious, I'm stuck in an elevator with the Messiah and, oh, and also literally God himself. This is awkward. Okay, maybe we can chat to pass the time then. You you heard me? I mean, sure. All right, Rob, should I? That's about his job. So what do you do at, at your job? You seem, re you seem really busy. I, uh, I fix lights mostly. But now I also deliver and refill high energy phosphor f uh, to structures that need them. High energy, you know, super concentrated, glowy stuff that had they had to process in factories. So it powers most of the city stuff. Oh, we used to have a small army of delivery robots doing that, but lately a bunch of them have been breaking down. So until they fix them, I'll just have to make more. Uh, I just have more work on my plate. I haven't slept so long in so long. When will the robots get fixed? I have no idea. It's all up to the scientists over at the labs. But they really... They seem really concerned about something else lately. Oh? Never a good sign when even the smart folks are worried. Alright, Rob. Should I... Ask about the city? The city's very big. It's smaller than it looks. Getting pretty crowded, too. First it was the refugee, refugees from the Barrens, and now more... Glen folks are moving in too. Oh, it's just safer here, you know. I mean, it's not—it's not heaven by any means. That square stuff that we just saw. That we just saw—you get more of that uh, here than anywhere else, apparently. I noticed. Lucky it only seems to affect the city's infrastructure. The landmass itself is still doing—is still holding up. Which is good, since there isn't much solid land here in the first place. Library. Resume awkward silence is one of, the <laughs> one of the things. Can you tell me about the library? I'm supposed to go there. Oh yeah, it's one of the main, one of my main delivery spots. Those reading lights uh, are pretty high maintenance. But I always feel out of place surrounded by smart people. Well, I guess you're pretty smart yourself, so you'll fit right in fine. You and Rob. Eh. Nobody tell him. Anyway, it was nice meeting you, uh... Nico. Right, see you around, kid. Gotta run now. Eh. He seems in a hurry. Guess we should hurry too, Rob. People are counting on us. Let's go find that library. Beep boop. Beep boop. Hello, dapper gentleman. Sigh. You all right? Ah, the Messiah. Perhaps this is a sign. Tell me you think we can fix the world with the sun. I honestly don't know. I'm getting mixed messages. I know. But what do you th what do you think? I think I think I should listen to Rob. After all, Rob helped me get this far. I'll take your faith as an, uh, for an answer then. What do you mean by that? It means whatever you think it means. Okay. So, many places to go. Hello. Evening news, evening news. Are you here to purchase a copy? 
No, newspapers are for grown-ups. Grown-ups? Yeah. What does that mean? It means people who aren't kids. Kids? Er, aren't you a kid? I am a robot. Right. Okay, I think the, this place was a little bit confusing. Let's see, what is this? Hello, person. The library's up ahead. Thanks. When the world ends, would it be better if it was gone in an instant or slowly fading away? To be honest, I'd rather the former. Okay. There's nothing here. Okay, so the library is here. Ah. Mine. Let's not go there just yet. This... Not from the inside, okay. Okay, go that way. Darkened out. Oh! You know who that is, right? Oh, did you see what happened? Yeah. My vision went blank for a second. And then I saw something. Like a really short dream. I wonder what that was about. You recognize that, huh? Can we go up this way? No, this is not, not, not the way. It's a plastic disc here. Looks like it's supposed to be going to something. We're really gonna take these with us? But they look so heavy. All right, you got this, pal. Huh, oh, they're actually pretty light. It's a big book. So it says, Understanding Robots. Ledger plan. The note attached it says, Thank you for working so hard, Mr. Lamplighter. Oh, this is where he lives. Most of the words are underlined. Yep, this is where he lives. <laughs> oh, squares. Let's not. <gasps> Look who it is. Whoa. Rob, did you see that fox just now? This ran behind the tree. Yeah, you recognize her. Sorry if you're looking for me. But I can't talk to you. Not now. Um. But I... But... Can you promise me something? Hmm? If you can find a way to return, please do. Er, what do you mean by that? No reply. Yeah, unfortunately we can't do anything with her tonight, but... There's no one here. Mysterious though, huh? But maybe uh, we should just go ahead and head over to the library. Get the ball rolling here. I think uh, they don't let me in unless I have a card. What? Uh, I didn't say anything. Stop staring at me then. I was just looking at your book. Yes, you're in a library. There's books in, a l in the library. Um, go bug the chatty one upstairs. Books are neatly placed on the shelf. Oh, hello. Do you need directions? Let's see. The area here is mostly historical accounts. The reference section is downstairs, and, uh, I'm not sure where the children's section is. Sorry. That's okay. I'm not really looking for books. Oh? Are you here to look for the author, then? No? Oh, that's good. I mean, that means you won't be disappointed. I've been volunteering here for months, and I've never seen him. Not even once. He works together with the head librarian, publishing 
on publishing, so you'd think he would at least show up once in a while. But he doesn't? Yeah, he seems kind of reclusive. Which is weird for a guy who supposedly travels the world. Maybe it's just around people. Here, it's currently off. Just looking for, for goodies. Is there a plaque? The author is so cool. I hear he can travel all over the world with a flying machine. That's how he gathers material for his books. Wow. Book club. So what do you think about the author? I don't know. <laughs> Have you read his stuff yet? If not, you should. A big book with a black clover on it. That says, A Comprehensive Guide to Phosphors. Uh, as a general rule, a phosphor lost its glow entirely. It cannot be relit unless exposed to the sun. If phosphor is merely dim, it may be possible to boost it through exposure to another phosphor of higher higher energy. But even so, the boosted phosphor will never return to its original brightness. Uh, oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, my God. All right, well, that's there if we need it. <laughs> No, don't get him addicted to One Piece. He has things to do. <laughs> um, what are you doing to that book? Don't worry, these are my own books I that I wrote. I just pulled them off the shelves to modify them. I have to cross out some sections. Most sections. Oh yeah, I remember this guy. Uh, how come? Because otherwise they'll think I copied him. Him? The author. I mean, I really don't see the point of writing anything anymore. The author just... Kind of, the author just gonna write about the same thing and then everyone will love it. Nobody's gonna remember the books that came out before his. Oh, uh, I mean, I ain't, I ain't hating. I can see why people go nuts over his stuff. That, that guy has a, got major talent. But it just hurts, you know? It's never fun when people call you copycat for something you wrote about first. I can see that. People call me a cat all the time. Even though I'm a person and cats are pets. And Mausers. I sure hope people don't think I eat mice. <laughs> then I guess we're in the same boat, kiddo. Sounds like average it's a Kai manga. <laughs> Excuse me. Oh, you are the messiah. Welcome. When I first entered the city, a big robot told me to look for a library on the, on the surface. This is the same library, right? Affirmative. Oh, goody. Well, we're here. What do we do now? Big Robot said to come here. There'd be clues here. That's a question for the head librarian, George. Allow me to call her. <laughs> Any day now. <laughs> uh, she's not picking up is she not here she's here she's in the archival room upstairs when she's con con concentrating on her work she will ignore any and all phone calls for several days yikes can you go get her in person then leaving this post is not in my programming can I go myself of course your cover room is accessible through the stairwell behind me. Gotcha, thanks. Unauthorized entry. Library card required. Yeah, yeah, we gotta get a library card. I remember this. Wait, what? Library card required for further access. I don't have a library card, though. Where can I get one? This is a question for the head librarian, George. Allow me to call her. Oh, God. <laughs> Yeah, anti-humor. Oh, you think it's funny? Of course you would. <laughs> She's not picking up. I figured. Are you sure she can't just let me through? 
Letting you through without a library card is against my programming. Even in an emergency, my programming is not flexible. I have not been tamed. <sighs> Alright, oop. Mine. Alright, yeah, very, very funny. Okay, so now we gotta go back to the city and construct a library card. A library card. Okay. Toaster man. It smells kind of nice. What is it? Breaded fish. I toasted the bread myself with my toaster head. I see. Eat the things from my body. Oh, hey. Hey, you looking for something? Yeah, I need to find a, I need to find a library card now. Any idea where I can get one? From the library? I tried that already. The person in charge wasn't there. Oh, uh maybe check out the factory? You just take the stairs to the end of the street and make make a turn. There's a lot of scientists there. Scientists read books, right? They might help you. What's your deal? Here for the foot for your photos? No? Alrighty then. I'll just uh stand here. Yeah, we need we need to take a photo, but we need like a regular We need a card or something. I, I it's so, so long ago. Uh is this the oh no, this is how we get into the tower. Can't can't do this just oop hello Yoink Can't do this just yet We getting close And now we've unlocked Unlocked shortcut Yeah, the science, the science folk are this way. How would I search for the One Piece? Um, as quickly and efficiently as humanly possible. to gain further access to the labs you must pass the security system test the uh you must change the color of the lights on a specific configuration allow me oh oh no yep don't have the access to that just yet The luminescence, luminescence index of the liquid red phosphor decreases by a factor of 3.57% this past week. Alarming to say the least. That's the sharpest decline I've seen in the number, and the number is only increasing. We'll have to further concentrate on phosphor now for it to be for it to be of any use. It's hard to believe, but there is a good chance the city could run out of light as, as little as six months. What are we gonna do? Well, I'm going to take this. Oh, this leads this way. Which means this way. Yeah. It may help you to go one color at a time. Management. If all else fails, wait for the puzzle to reset. Maybe you'll get an easier one next time. It also will help you to write down previous attempts. So we really just gotta brute force it, huh? Beep boop. This is the printer room where machine parts are made. 
Also robots. No, lots of incident. There's a robot in it. Okay, uh... One lights is correct. Two lights is correct. Okay, this, this one is correct. Three lights is correct. Oh my god. Okay, the two on the end are correct. Three lights is correct. Four lights is correct. Oh my god. Four lights is correct. Four lights is... Five lights is correct. Actually, it's correct. Hey! <laughs> oh, you proud of me, bud? Yeah, you proud of me. I did it. I was like, oh god, I can't do this. And then it happened. Oh dear, the squares. My robot! What happened? I don't know. I left for a minute and... Oh no. The squares be coming. Okay. I'm just looking for collectibles. Right now. The, this, this seems pretty straightforward from this point. Alright, the science men, we're not going to bother with them. Pretty sure we don't need to talk to everybody. That dude has a soda can for a head. How does one go through life like that? Sure, a lot of computers here. They look important, too. There she is. Hello? Oh, shoot. I had known you'd be here so soon, I would have turned off the dark and... The darn lock. Hello there. Sorry about the weird security measures. It's okay. Rob helped me solve it. Yep, we did it to we did it together. On our with our own brains for once. Did they now? So, can I help you with anything? Yeah. Do you know how I can get a library card? Library card. You have to ask the library for that? You have to ask the library for that. I tried. I needed to see the librarian, but I can't get to see her without a library card. But at the same time, she's the one who gives out the library cards. Really? Yeah, that sounds like that sounds like George, all right. I'm sorry you caught her on a bad day. Uh, wait, I know. I can just give you my library card. It'll be hard for me to get another one. Wow, well, thanks. Here, you're all set, I think. Wait, shoot. Yeah, the front desk library bots have facial recognition. My photos on the card don't match you. Unless I tape a photo of, of your face on... Uh, uh, unless I tape a photo of my face on your face. Um, that was a joke. Who knows, maybe you'll get lucky and the robot will take, take it anyway. Worst comes to worst, you can always find somewhere to take a photo. Thank you for spelling it out for me. So I'm looking out on the shelf. It's a tube of glitter glue. You can have that if you want. Never know when you need glitter to glitter things up, right? Uh, are you sure? Yeah, I have tons of those. Freaking glitter gets everywhere. Just take some. All right. You got. Hey, Rob. Does the lady look kind of familiar to you? What if she's related to the robot lady who gave me the amber? I almost want to ask her about it. Should I? All right, let's ask her. So, you've been walking around all over the world, huh? Mm-hmm. Jeez, I can't imagine. You re get really tired sometimes. Kinda. But I don't mind. It's actually re really... It's actually really pretty. <laughs> Glad you think so. Even with the sun gone, the world still has a... This world's still a beautiful place. What did the world look like with the sun? Oh. Um, you know, kind of embarrassing to admit how little of it I actually have seen. Oh? Ironic, isn't it? Even though I'm the world's leading researcher. All I do is stay here and build robots. They're the ones exploring the world. I just write down the data, crunch numbers, generate graphs. Right, I've been seeing robots everywhere. I just thought 
thought it was... I just thought it was because the world is too dangerous for most people to explore. It's not far from the truth, actually. But I knew someone who still does research f firsthand. Oh? Even after segments of land started collapsing and access to the world, the more remote a areas became difficult. I mean, she outright built a machine that could fly. I mean, he outright built a machine that could fly. Something we all thought was not physically possible. Oh, that's... I asked him about working with us, so he provides us with all sorts of insights from time to time. Yep, you, you recognize that, too, again. We're hearing about him again. But for some reason, he really didn't want to build robots. Or more specifically, coding them. How come? Beats me. I mean, he's happy to work with robots. In fact, he's even... Uh, it's been a while since we last talked. He must be busy with, with his books now, yeah? Don't overwork yourself, okay? The journey's just as important as, as the end goal. Cliche, but true. Alright, well, she didn't tell us anything about silver. Um, can I fast travel? Uh, I can't. We're, I guess we're indoors. Okay. Okay, so... We'll go get our photo. There's a lot here. Looks like paper or something might come out of it. For your photos? Actually, yeah. I need to take a picture for reasons. Well, I got good news and bad news. Good news is that the photo center is right behind me. Bad news is that it doesn't work right. <laughs> it doesn't work right. Yeah, you're catching on quick. After operations ended in the Barrens, this place got shut down. After all the engineers lost their jobs, and became street vendors. Maybe Rob, we can figure out figure out from from them. That's good. Certainly help out with people inspired IDs like me. Okay, I have to put the lenses. Oh, there's several of them. Oh no. Okay, so I guess we do have to talk. He's be one of the camera engineers, right? Camera. Oh, joyous memories. We went through thick and thin together. And by that I mean the concave lens did. Okay, concave lens is second, then. Can you know me how to fix the camera? It's been a while. I'm pretty sure that the buggy lens goes in one of the... One of the ends, but I forget which. Okay, so... I'm pretty sure that the bul bulgy lens... Okay. Thick, concave. Let's put them in so we don't lose track. Anything you remember? I worked the camera see when arranging these lenses to make sure that the thin lens is positioned between the two cur curved ones. Okay, so thin. And then convex. Hey, did it. All right, smile, buddy. Getting your picture taken. There you go. Ah, my eyes. Photo of me. My eyes always this big? Yep. Glitter glue. Photo of Nico. So it's covered in glue and glitter. Got it. To the library. Life isn't so hard when you have a library card. Authenticating barcode. Executing facial recognition. Photo match. Successful. You're good to go. Have a nice day, Miss Kip. Maybe I should have changed the name.
Okay, so interesting thing about this character is that apparently every time you play this game, um, a different side of the dice is facing forward, and each side of the dice is a different personality. Uh, first time I played this, uh, I got the one, and apparently we got it again, so that's kind of weird. So, someone here to see the brilliant George, eh? Code wind of my genius and couldn't help but come see your... Come see yourself, eh? Um, don't answer. Of course you are. What else could you possibly want? Actually, I need your help. Can you tell me what I need to do? I think I'm supposed to go to the tower. Oh, but of course I can help. For I, the brilliant and intelligent head of library, head librarian George, beholder of all knowledge, believe you're supposed to go to the tower. That's what I said. But how exactly? Through the tower entrance room. Alas, going beyond the small entrance room requires ancient forbidden knowledge that even eludes even George. But for, but fear not. For that knowledge happens to be recorded in some cryptic tome in a long dead language. Then know that I, George, am fluent in several dead languages. I see. Looks poking out from the shelf. Uh, another fruit visit. Mm, okay. Just gonna go ahead and sketchbook. Just gonna go ahead and uh, move out from the shelf. Hey, this book actually about clovers. Although the pigmentation is primarily black, these leaves display incredible resilience when exposed to sunlight. These uh, these curious plants are most resilient and can thrive. This is just lore stuff, so I'm just gonna go ahead and. If anybody's interested, I'm gonna put it on camera. Oh, hey. It's a profit bot. Feel free to pause. Oh, that's a bed. That means we're close to the end here. No goodies, huh? So, I think the strange journal? Can't combine those two. Oh. You have this book, though. I think it's written in some sort of words I don't recognize. Ah! An ancient book. Written by no less than the most ancient... M no less than the most ancient... Wait a minute. This isn't ancient at all. But it's written in a dead language. Nonetheless. Nevertheless. It's time for me to unleash my brilliance. For George, me, professor of at least one PhD, shall translate this... This will take some time, however. I see. Eh, excuse me. What's what's this? You're sleepy. A little. Fear not, because I have read a book on hospitality before, and thus have prepared for the exact situation. Guest room is in the attic down the hall. No pickups around here. No, no goodies. All right. All right. We are all sleepy. <laughs> Including me, but we're, we're very close to the end, so we're gonna... Oh, yeah. But she deeply beloved the mul multiverse theory regarding alternate versions. She like... Yeah, I think this is, was a... This was a, a clue to the, um... This character having multiple personalities. Alright. I'm tired from walking. Alright, if I take a nap? Yes. We're very close to the end, though. Oh, look, it's Nico being happy. Oh, but what's this? Something happened. <gasps> the sun. It broke. But it was a, it was a dream. Don't worry. It was a dream. Hey, Rob? I guess you saw my dream. Yes. It was... Come on, let's go. I've done it! I've finished the daunting task of translating this journal. Oh, that was fast. But of course, I am the speediest translator in recent history. 
Anyway, I made you a line-by-line -line transcript. Looks like this journal might be meant for Rob. Huh? Here, take a look yourself. Greetings, Rob. If you can finally read this, that means you are near the tower. The tower is the domain of an elusive entity. This brings this being is connected to the world. For for now, you can think of it as the spirit of the world. It has no physical form, but it can communicate through computers and other machinery. You know who I am talking about, of course. When you first arrived in this, with here with our savior, it no doubt contacted you right away. Though its own means, though its own. Through its own means, the entity will guide the both of you to the tower. The entry room is at the tower base. Not only do you need the sun there, but also three pieces of the previous sun. The savior will not be able to do anything there. Y you, Rob, on the other hand, look at the pattern on the floor. Do as it says. The window will be gone, so you'll need to bring it back. That's there. That's the last of it. The rest of the pages are torn out. You didn't... Uh, you didn't do this, did you? No? Shame. I was wondering what window was supposed to mean. Yeah, I wonder what that means, too. Uh, Night at the Museum. Uh, I haven't seen it, actually. I heard about it, but I haven't seen it. Shame. I was wondering what window was supposed to mean. Oh, well. I guess Rob will have to figure that one out. Gee, I wonder what window is supposed to mean. Right. By the way, what does it mean by three pieces of the previous sun? I only have this sun. Ah. This is a question George can answer. It means you need items containing yellow phosphor, the rarest of the phosphors. Said to absorb sunlight for the longest time and never fade out. Oh. You have a piece of amber and a feather. They're both glowing yellow. But alas, you are missing the third, no? Fear not. For George, collector of rare artifacts, will assist you. Yeah. A D6 that glows in the dark. Oh. Looks like you. Yes. Now you'll never forget my face. How could you possibly forget a person with a dice head? The face of knowledge. Ah, thank you. Good luck on your journey, small child. George shall bid you farewell now. New friend. Anything else appear around here? I'm assuming there's going to be more during the, the second run through. But that is for another day. For now, we'll, we're will we just going to finish uh, finish this off. And... Leave. Uh oh. Hey, Rob? Do you remember where the cafe... Oh, yes. Oh, good. Nice and because, well, I'm a little hungry. Actually, really hungry. I haven't eaten anything since I got here. So is it okay we get some food before we enter the tower? I hope they have pancakes. Of course we can. Through the power of fast travel. To make this go quick. Cafe. Hey, oh hey, you're back. Did you manage to fix the elevator? Mm-hmm. Rob and I went to the surface already. And well, I remember there being a cafe here. Do you have pancakes? We sure do. Oh, I bet that makes you happy. Wait, I don't have any money. Maybe I can help you wash dishes or something? No, no, it's on the house. It's the least I can do for the savior, right? Here, why don't you take a seat? I'll go fry some up for you. Pancakes! Pancakes! <laughs> Pancakes are so good! Thank you so much! Alright, Nico. I promise I'll get you some pancakes when we're, when we're done with all this. No problem. You look really hungry. Yeah, this will be my last chance to eat something before I go to the tower. 
Ah, gotcha. So I guess pancakes are your favorite food? Mm-hmm. Well, almost. My favorite food in the whole world... Uh, my favorite food in the whole world are the special pancakes my mama makes. She likes to put... She likes to pick, ha pick hazelnuts and grind them up into the batter. Oh, wow, that sounds amazing. It tastes amazing. I wonder if you can get that at IHOP. She always made them when I was feeling sad. Or lonely, or... Mama. I really miss her. I just... I have a bad feeling all of a sudden. Am I even here to save the world? People have been saying how the sun won't fix anything. I don't even know why I'm here. I just want to see my mom again. Oh, uh... There, there. It's gonna be okay. I'm sure you'll be able to save the world. You're a tough kid. You managed to get this far already. <laughs> this far already, right? Yeah, but... And you get home afterwards, right? Right. Hey, want some more pancakes? It's okay. I'll be fine. Yeah. Thanks for coming by. Mm. Mm-hmm. Thanks for listening. And for the pancakes. No problem. Good luck. We got a badge of pancakes. Elevator. All right. It's end game. Mhm. Mm Awkward elevator silence. Uh, actually, I don't think I need to fast travel. It should be right here, right? Yeah, it's right there. Okay, if I remember correctly, I'm supposed to close the window when Nico is on the, the X. Uh, hopefully I'm remembering this correctly and we don't botch this up, all right. Uh, yeah, here goes nothing. Please open up and be okay. Oh, he's okay. He's here. It's a, he's, a, he's a little sad, but it's fine. We're back. Okay, that was a, that was a close one, huh? This is the inside of the tower? It's a lot darker than I thought. Wait, where's the sun? Rob, do you know what happened to the sun? Uh-oh. Looks like, looks like we lost communication. Rob? Come on, Rob, say something. We're still here, buddy. Just, you can't hear us. What's going on? found some. Hello, Nico. Hello? Congratulations, you are now inside the tower. 
Are you talking to me now? Correct. You were always talking to Rob before. Where's... Rob has already left. I had to res resort to contacting you directly. We're still here. Wait, so Rob's gone just like that? Correct. For good? Correct. Rob has already finished their mission. And so have you, Nico. Here, you can rest now. Everything that happened here is like a bad dream. When you wake up, you'll be home. Oh. But... What's wrong? I thought there'd be more to it, you know? That there was supposed... We were supposed to go to the top of the tower. I thought there was supposed to be somewhere we need to put the sun in. And now I don't even have the sun anymore. Rob is just gone. This feels wrong. But you did... But you did good. You saved the world, Nico. Are you not happy? I guess I am. But it's just... No, we're not done. Or maybe we're supposed to. say goodbye to Rob. And as for you, Rob, we're done here. Please don't return to this world anymore. Oh, boy. No. Let me back in. It's not over. Regardless of the enemy, totally, there's still more story. Doc Documents, my games, one shot. Look for this symbol. Okay. What do I do with you? This is crazy, right, huh? Right, buddy? Here, hold on. Let me get back to the... One... Oh, uh... Reduce. <laughs> Once it's active, please relaunch the game. Okay, so... Close this. Okay. Hey, you know, let me close this. Here it is. I have it. Oh, oh, something's happening. Yes, we did it. We're back. Nico? Hello? Rob? Was that you just now? I thought I heard your voice. In my dream. Guess we're still not here. Uh, we're, we're still here. We just gotta... Reconnect. Wait, there's something in my pocket. I don't remember putting it in there. Clover. Okay, so... I don't remember exactly what I'm supposed to... Oh, I gotta talk to the computer. 
You're still here. Nico, why are you still here? You. Why did you come back, Rob? I told you to stay away. You don't tell me what to do. And you knew I tried to cut the story short. Is that it? You want more out of me, is that it? Fine. If you want to leave... If you don't want to leave, I'll make sure you never do. Okay, so this is what I was doing last time. Back when I told you about the entity as... Back when I told you about the entity as little as possible. So this is what I had to do last time. I had to line up this with this. And it shows you the correct path to take. Apologies for that, I didn't want to put the librarian in danger. This being has a habit of silen silencing people who learn of its true nature. Regrettably, I have seen it happen to dear friends. Wait, where, where's Nico? Oh, he's, he's down there. Ah, <laughs> uh, but I do. Uh, but do not worry. The entity cannot touch you. Better not. Oh, we gotta go back this way. Nor can it do anything to me. It's all talk. I already left the world on my own terms. I never meant for the entity to exist. Oh, wrong, wrong window. Hold on, I got it, it, it. There we go. But now that it's fully sen sentient, one thing became clear. The entity seeks death. Death to itself, death to the world, and relentless desire to manifest physically. It's nice that it lines up for me. Nico, where are you? Oh, there you are. You have already seen the scars. Right now, the entity is doing everything it can to impede your progress. Start, starting, ugh. starting for stalling for even a few minutes before you inevitably, ah, before you inevitably bring the sun to the tower, tower summit. That's where. That's where you, God, will make the final judgment of this world. Of course, the entity will contact you again there. And when it does, it will trick you into shattering the sun. This will end the world instantly. Very, pretty shocking, huh, buddy? <sighs> dot, dot, dot. Dot, dot, dot. A lot of dots. No, no. This is not, it is not that simple. I'm sorry, I do not know what... It, what to do in a situation like this. But I think I have to tell you the truth. The sun is the sun is the Messiah's tie to the world. Uh oh, hold on. 
one of these. To, <laughs> have to undo all this now. Let's not screw this up. As long as the sun is intact, the Messiah remains trapped here. That's a lot of things I gotta light up. Oh, we're good. Shattering the sun may terminate this world, but... It also, it's also the only way for the Messiah to return home. All right, hold on, where, where is Nico? He's over there. Th this is a little bit tedious, admittedly. Yeah, no kidding, the, the the entity is stalling me, jeez. Got it. I did not realize things would end up like this. Please forgive me. It's a light bulb. Thank goodness it's safe. I guess Rob isn't coming back. We're right here, buddy. Both of us. Rob? Yes. Is that really you? I thought you were gone. I never left. <laughs> he goes real shocked out to you. Yeah, really. Oh, I was feeling a bit scared back there. I was completely alone. But that was silly of me to assume, wasn't it? I guess we need to figure out where to go now and... The sun. It lit up on its own. You should pick it up, right? Yep. Look, it's the, the house we started in. Oh, don't mind if I do. So you actually made it here. Uh-oh. I guess you win, Rob. I'll tell you how to save the world, then. When you reach the summit, shatter the light bulb and... Move that out of the way. It wants us to shatter the light bulb. We probably shouldn't do that, right? I'm just humoring you. I know you've been getting help from a certain someone. He already told you about the choice, didn't he? Are you still planning to save the world, Rob? Why are you trying so hard for this? <laughs> it better not say, and kill Nico. Yeah, right. It would never say that. Have you ever figured out what this world is?
I told you at the beginning your mission is to help Nico leave. Because Nico isn't part of this world. Nico is the only thing worth saving here. The final choice is up to you. I can't go against my programming. You have one shot, Rob. If you choose to smash the light bulb, Nico wakes up home and like it was all just a dream. But if you let Nico return the sun, the child will have to bear the weight of th this sacrifice. At least tell Nico the truth. Eh -eh. You do care about Nico, don't you? Of course I do, right, buddy? Yeah. Sure is taking a while. Guess the elevator leads to the top of the tower. Are you excited, Rob? Finally gonna save the world. I don't know for real this time, because you're here. <laughs> and then, I'll go home for real this time, too. Can't wait to see everyone again. Are you okay, Rob? You seem a little quiet. Nico? Yeah? I need to tell you something. We can't save both. The world and you. What? What's that supposed to mean, Rob? To send you home, we must break the light bulb. What? But won't that... Won't that end the world? Yeah. I don't want that to happen. So what happens if we save the world? What happens to me? I don't know. You don't... You don't? Mm. Well, here we are. This is where the sun belongs. If I put the sun here, we'll be able to save the world, right? But if I want to go home, I'll have to... break it. Oh. Rob, what should I do? This image right here has been, like, burned into my brain ever since we did this. It's the right thing to do. <sighs> Alright, well, last time we chose to return the sun. In fact, that Nico looks both ways. Which one do you think we should do, guys? Again, uh, KFAB off, it doesn't really matter because we're going to be coming back to this. I mean, we did, we did return the sun last time. Return the sun, connect with the continuity. I mean, he's going to return the sun again, you know, during the next... I mean, all right, if, if that's really... You really want to do that, or you want to see the other ending? Could do a what-if episode. I mean, I guess continuity-wise... Well, either way, continuity-wise, it's going to work, but... Uh, Nico is not happy either way. It's okay. it's gonna be okay, buddy. Don't worry. We return the sun.
Return the sun. Return the sun. All right, we return the sun. You're right. Can't just leave everyone here to die. I believe last time I quoted Mr. Spock when I said the needs of the many outweigh the needs of the few. Thanks for your help, Rob. I promise I'll, I'll be okay. Well, that was uh, the initial playthrough. Yo, you okay, Nico? Nico? Nico, you okay? Oh, no, 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 don't, don't cry, buddy, don't cry. L we're not, listen, we're not done yet. We're not done yet. There's more, there's more game, okay? There's more game. Look, 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 everyone's... Everyone's got the sun back. We're not done yet. It's, it's not going to end that way. <laughs> Memories are flowing back to him. It's, it's going to be okay, buddy. It's going to be okay. All right, come here. Come here. I I can't. My VTuber doesn't have arm movement, so I can't, <laughs> I can't do I shouldn't be laughing at this. It's going to be okay, Nico. I gotta say the um, I, I'm still I'm I'm kind of impressed with the, how they they organize this for a console. Just real talk for a second. Yeah, I didn't realize how many people worked on this game. I think this was like a. Like a little, small dev, like, indie title. Thanks for playing. Now, let me see here. Well, oh, well, it's gone. Okay. All right. Well, uh, that was one shot. Um, but we are not done with this just yet. Nico, Nico, it's going to be okay. It's going to be okay. This song is making, yeah, it, the, the game really does like hit you emotionally. So, uh, here's the cool thing about the switch. I'm pretty sure it's safe to close this game, but, uh, I'm going to, I'm going to leave this in sleep mode and it should, it, it stays active even when the, uh, the console is shut. So hope, hopefully that keeps everything. Okay. Uh, I'm going to have to go, I'm going to have to tend to Nico here. He seems to be, um, seems to be a little upset over this. I told you it's going to be okay, buddy. When we're going to come back Wednesday and we're going to make it all right. Okay. So don't, don't be, don't be too upset about any of this. All right. Just don't be too upset. All right. Well, uh, that'll be it for tonight. Um, again, really cool game. I like how they set it up for console, but we are not done yet. Yes. Tend to him. <laughs> tend to him. Tend to him. <laughs> he'll be okay. We'll we'll get him some pancakes in the morning and he'll, he'll be back to normal on Wednesday. All right. So anyway, thanks for joining me. Um, please give me a follow if you haven't done so already and go to Rob the Casual Gamer where I upload all my streams. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe because it helps the channel. And uh, yeah, Nico, Nico, it's, it's, it's going to be okay, I promise. All right. Uh, thanks for being here and I will see you guys later.